Uh, uh. I raised my stream from the dead. Now I can raise this from the dead in game. Oh god, the drop frames are absurd. Give me a second, ladies and gents. I was fucking about with OBS Sense for the Elgato, and they seem to have seeped into PC stuff. We've already dropped 276 frames, and we're on the start and soon screen. So give me a second, ladies and gents. I'm gonna ungumbunga my way through these settings and get this shit sorted. Ba, ba, ba. No, no, don't want that. Don't want that. I would love that. Don't want that though. That's bullshit. Fuck that. Okay. Okay. Uh, apply that. There we go. Hi right, guys, you doing all right? Just sorting out the settings here. Because woof, we've got. It says the dropped frames at the moment are 742. I think some of my settings when I was dicking around with the Elgato, the Elgato seeped in. So give me a second there. Hey yo yo. Dead love, thank you for following my man. Uh, apply. The video. Let's see here. Uh, hotkeys. Uh, oh, okay, the drop frame is going down. Okay, that's good. We're getting somewhere. We are getting somewhere. Make control is that? Yeah, it's going down. Good, good. So it should be. Stupid thing. Stupid thing. It went from 25% dropped frames to 9%. So we're getting close to zero. Then we'll begin. I'm going to get a drink while I wait. Oh, what have I got? Oh, a spare bottle of Brothers from a month ago. And it's grapefruit. Let's give it a go. I'll turn off the lights too. And dim the lights for the audience. Just the way you like it. Cool. Oh. Okay, we're on seven percent dropped frames. We're getting there. Once it gets to zero, I'll, I'll begin. How have you lot been? You been all right? Ah, whoa! Fucking hell, Grapefruit Brothers has got a scent to it, let me tell you. You guys getting your boosters all lined up? Yeah, mine's, uh, well, I'm quite busy in January. My is looking a little bit busy, so I've yet to book mine yet, but I'm going to as soon as possible. Now, I can't do mine during December or January because uh, I'll be in Scotland then for a trip. So when I get back, I'll have to do it. When I get back and I've got my non-stop shifts coming up. So yeah, should be fun. Your puppy's adorable, Irish. You need more pictures. Welcome to the pet tax group. Got the trip sword. Yeah, yeah, I just left it to Sarah. She's fine. She's got it all sorted out. Let's leave it to her. I actually have not had time to like properly look into it at the moment. Sarah just said, well, we're, we're staying here, we're driving around for five days, and yeah, so on and so forth. And I was like, cool, sweet, all right, thumbs up. As long as it's an adventure, I don't care. Let's do it. Right, we're on 4.8%. Really weird. As soon as I turned it on, it went to 25% dropped frames. That's probably as a result of me dicking around with the Delgado. But I've confirmed that the Elgato does work, the new one that I got, so we can stream Switch and PS4 games. <laughs> if we ever do that with a PC, I don't know. Let's go double check some settings quickly before we begin. Uh, this works because I was already on Twitch watching your REA stream, so easy transition. Hey, finally catching up on those videos, eh, Nick? Fun times. Can't all miss the streams with the big booba lady. 
who won Best Voice Actor, by the way. Well fucking earned by Maggie uh, Robertson, I think her second name is. Because I will find you, and I will break you. Yeah, she does a good job. She's awesome. Uh, max performance. Yes, please. And in fuck shot really bad. DDP, thank you for the photo. Mate, I got fucked up really bad when Lady D got killed. I was what upset. Like that was the end of the game for me after that point. And she's the first boss. Yeah, you tell stream elements, Jerry. Oh, sorry. I thought you talked to <laughs> I thought you talked to stream elements. Now you're talking to Sofix. Stream bot consumes links, right? It does. Slots. Oh yeah, I'll give you guys slots quickly. Give me a moment. Enjoy my pretties. Oh god, why is the following thing all the way over there? I don't know why. Alright. There we go. That's that sword. Oh man. Yeah, wow, I was fucking around with Elgato, wasn't I? The following thing was so damn small. You're right, please do, bro. Slots Chun is tearing away at chat as usual. Hey, Pit Pick. Hiya, please do. I am playing a rhythm game, indeed. This is the first rhythm game that I am streaming on Twitch. Uh, only rhythm game experience I have had is Muse Dash, uh, uh, Yakuza Karaoke, and uh, training mode in fighting games. Because I literally make noises sometimes through a rhythm when I want to remember a combo. Which obviously throws me off when I go online because of the lag. But a rollback, I can now make all the noises I want and kick as much ass as I want. So yeah, thank fuck for a rollback. Hey, Saber, Reaper Scroll for 40 months. Time to get that groove on. Time to feel the heartbeat. Cheers, man. Thanks all for sticking by for so long. That's awesome. Loan the Persona dancing games. Nope! Because it's taste that has been lingering for far too long. Put me way off and I was like, that's dumb. And also they released a fighting game at the same time where I can also make dumb rhythmic noises. So I'm going with the fighting game. <laughs> Does a Muse Dash have a Rhythm Doctor level? It's cool. I'm not sure, actually. It's been ages since I played Muse Dash. Also, welcome to the chat, Lazarin. Feeling better, but you need some headache meds. Oh, shit, man. Get on that. Yeah, Rhythm Game or, or Fighter? Like, what the fuck am I going to pick exactly? Excited for that port. Yes! I'm glad they're bringing it back. I'm glad because, like, um... Like, bear, bear in mind, like, Persona's got its own fans. Like, a lot of us included, I'm sure. But in the FGC, uh, Persona 4 Arena is actually, like, a, a pretty beloved underground fighting game. So, <laughs> ironically, fighting game fans are more excited for Persona 4 Ultimax being ported to Steam on a rollback than actual Persona fans, which is really fucking funny to me. But it's the truth. Because, oh, I don't want to go into that whole discussion about... I'm fucking entitled some fans can be sometimes. It's fans in general, but man, I see, I saw some shit on social media after that, and it wasn't pretty. I was just happy that we're getting a fantastic fire with Persona characters on rollback for to Steam. Well fucking happy. So yeah. It's definitely gonna get rolled back. It's gotta have rollback. Especially because all of these games that have been like... Uh, all these new games, they've all, they've, they've, well, yeah, they're all getting rollback implemented. So I would not be surprised if P4 gets it too. It should do. If it doesn't, then that will ruin it a little bit. And by a little bit, I mean a lot. Because rollback is a saving fucking grace. Let me tell you. I was playing DNF, the beta, actually, uh, today, about two hours ago. And, like, the best thing about rollback is that I can't get angry when I get my ass rocked. 
Because I, at least I could say it was my fault and not the fuck ass lag that I get in every fighting game ever. Like, I'm, I'm literally getting my shit torn out in the corner and it's like, there's a way to get out, but I don't know what it is and I can't bail on the lag. This is all me. Oh my god, I got perfected, but I don't care because it was fun anyway. So, uh, yeah, holy shit, is it not a revolution and a half? Fucking rollback is the future, my dudes. Did not feud, did not finish. Well, like, these nuts fire. <laughs> so, so, so good. Oh my god. Uh, oh, Sarah's here. I forgot about Sarah. Just your S oh S in tonight? Yeah, I can I can S tonight. So I hang out and do work for the rest of the year. Yeah, I'm free for for a bit of sim. I can't say it on Twitch, you bitch. No, I know what you're trying to do. Yeah, we can watch it tonight. I'll be well cool with it. Look at that DNF car looks like Guilty Gear. A lot of people have been comparing it as a cross between Guilty Gear Strive and Grand Blue Fantasy, if anyone played. Yeah, a lot of like these weird online games are now getting the Arxis treatment, which is nice to see. Hi, Days Paradise. How's it going? Our frames have dropped to 1.8. This should be okay. I'm I'm going to go transition to the game now because you guys have been waiting for too long now. And we're going to see if this... This is gonna be okay. Are you ready? Three, two, one. I know this is the title screen, but it looks all right. It's looking pretty good. What about you guys? It's looking all right so far? Is it? GG! Or is it? What do you think? We're looking good. Yep. <laughs> oh, I've been waiting. I've been waiting for the last 20 minutes to do that. <laughs> oh, oh. I, I'm, I'm ready to, I'm ready to play some rhythm game. I'm ready to save some fucking lives. Are you ready to save some lives? I'm ready to save some lives. Apparently, it's like a one-button rhythm game from what I've heard. So let's do this. Oh shit! I am. Um... Oh, oh yeah. There we go. Oh god! Apparently, circle is not to go back. Oh god! Apparently, every what? Oh, apparently, every button is to accept. All right, all right. Uh, welcome to 420 points, bright to I pressed triangle and circle to cancel, and I just pressed accept for everything. So I guess we're playing the game. Hello, Ian. Thanks for joining Rhythm Doctor, our remote defibrillation internship program. We'd have to, we'd like to uh, do this in person, but everyone's working from home these days. Let's look at the screen for a little bit. If that was on webcam, I'd be looking right into your soul. If I had a webcam, which I don't, so just assume that I'm looking into your soul after hearing that quote. Anyways, before we begin, you need to know something important. Treating patients in Rhythm Doctor is ideally done by slamming the space bar. You know what? I like the sound of that. This is so that you can hear the space bars clack. And use your ears to tell when the sound of your space bar is perfectly in time with the beat. You might be in a situation where you cannot slam your spacebar. I don't think there's ever a situation where you shouldn't slam. In that case, you can tap lightly to the beat instead. And... Do you prefer to slam or tap? Uh, I mean, uh, it's always nice to have a bit of a mix between slam and tap. I mean, uh, to tap you need to slam. And to tap, you need to slam. It's a yin and yang sort of process between the two, I feel. Like, you can tap when you're feeling good, but when an absolute banger comes on, you got to start. Mmm, so we're going to slam. I just convinced myself. In my, my own mind just convinced myself. Hey, filth. You doing all right, man? How's it going? I'll slam everything I see on screen. I can't wait. Commit. Slam. Okay, we're going to slam the spacebar and playing Rhythm Doctor. 
Now, to make sure the sound is synced to what you see uh, in your screen, let's do some visual collaboration. Please turn your volume up to hear the beeps. All right. In this part, press left and right to make the green lights blink earlier or later. Okay. Try to match it so the green lights blink at the same time as the beep sounds. When you feel they are in sync, press space to confirm. Just have to write to sing the beep sound. Okay. Oh my fucking Christ, Neon. Holy shit, how many gift subs is that? Five Christ, man. God, Neon is it is the season for Mr. Neon here. Holy shit, thank you so much, man. Christ, enjoy the subs. Enjoy all the emotes, guys. Thank you very much. Oh my god. Thank you, Neon. You said you slam everything. <laughs> I think it sounds fine as it is. Awesome. Visual should now be synced to audio. Finally, we have to calibrate your spacebar's input. Last part, I promise. Press space on the seventh beat. Try to be as accurate as possible. All right, start now. Oh my fucking Christ, better fair. Holy shit. Oh, you threw me off. Fucking thank you. Wow, 5,000 bits, man. Holy shit. Thank you very much, people. Oh my god. Neon and Benefit, thank you very, very, very much for your patronage. It is much appreciated. Thank you very much. Hope you guys have an absolute wonderful Christmas because holy shit, you guys are giving. Thank you very much. Oh my god. Holy fuck. Ah! I slam it high enough. Slam it harder, Joe. <laughs> what the fuck? Wait, what? Hang on a minute. Oh no, it's 7% to level 5 hype. I thought we got it for a second. I almost cried my eyes out. Thank fuck for that. Alright, I'm going to continue playing the game. My rank was D, apparently. D for... Disturbingly awesome. The input should now be properly calibrated. You should now be ready to treat patients. <laughs> oh, thank you very much, Bella First, love you with you. You learned how to press a button on the keyboard. You may now take your Hippocratic Oath and save lives. <laughs> Get level five, you cunts. Don't listen to her. She's silly. Press any button. Oh, all right. Here we go. Uh, story mode, custom levels, level editor. Oh yeah, oh, of course, I remember getting the making of custom levels in. I bet there's some insane shit. OST on YouTube. I'm immediately drawn to this. I am immediately- FUCK! I calm down, everyone. Everyone calm the fuck down. Everyone please chill. I'm trying to save people's lives if I'm pressing a button and you guys are making me panic. Oh my fucking Christ. Guys, Anonymous and La Lazarin. Stop. Don't listen to the gremlin in chat. She doesn't mean anything. No. Stop. <laughs> this is a, this is a, this is a very important. It's, it's a very, 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 very delicate game. And you lot are distracting me with your lovely get. Oh my god, we reached it. Thank you guys so much. Oh my god. What the fuck happened, dude? <laughs> oh, I mean, I'm gonna headbutt this face buff throughout this entire stream because of you guys. Oh my fucking Christ. Thank you guys. But, wow, level, level 5 hype train. <laughs> Oh, thank you everyone, you lot are really cool, and I'm glad that you enjoy the stuff that we do, and I hope you all have a merry, 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 crimbo, crit, Chris, crit, cripple, cripple, heart, cripple of month, thank you, oh my god, holy shit, chew, chew, you ch you've cho cho chosen me, thank you, thanks, <laughs> 
Uh... Mm. Ah. <laughs> Great. Now I can't form clearer sentences more than usual now because of you lot. Look at what you're doing to me. Look at what you're doing to me. It's my first rhythm game. And you're absolutely trying to make sure that it's going to be the hardest thing ever. You can't let me get away of pressing a single button to play a game well, can you? Can you? You have to go and fluff to me. Thank you for the level 5 high. <laughs> Thank you for the level 5 high train, guys. You're fucking nuts. Make sure you save that hard earned cash for yourselves as well. You lovely people. Thank you very much. Should we, uh, should we play the game? <laughs> uh, should we? Oh, for fuck. Oh! What the? Oh, come on. Fuck off with this shit. You, oh, fuck. It's from a bottle as well, a glass fucking bottle, and it's a big one. Guys, and your follow ups, man. Irish did attack. Scare. Wait, yeah, Irish did attack. Scarecrow followed up. Irish and Scarecrow are now happy. Sarah Sang comes in uh, with uh, shit cunt move. Golden Witch suddenly shoots in with his follow up. It hit right in the heart. Congrats. You beat the boss. You beat Joey Joe. You did it. You fucking drained my HP to zero. Ah! Okay, now what? I instinctively punch her desk when. When Dave did his thing, oh my fucking god. Wait, okay. Right, I need to... <laughs> let, me, let me... Let me scroll. I was promised that I was only gonna press one button during this. You're making me scroll, you're making me click. How could you guys be so mean? Alright, I've done Irish's down. Um, Crow, um, I've got to, I've got to compliment me. Oh, fuck, this is always the worst one. I, I can't edit those out, I'm sorry, chat. <coughs> um... I'm sorry, I can't, I can't edit out horrible noises. All right, uh, I've got to compliment myself. Fuck, all right. Um, uh, uh, I have power to hopefully meet my goal next year. And that is a step down a day from lifeguarding so I can focus more time on me and Ben's channel. So we can do cool and groovy stuff. And, and drink more like this and get our facts wrong and um, prove ourselves as boomers by not knowing what on the fleek means or whatever the fuck it's called. And because I matter and I have the power to do so. Ow! There, I said it. I got another one coming up too. Sarah, what's your kazoo cover request? What do you want me to do? What, 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 what do you want me to do? What would you like me to blow? I mean, in, in my kazoo. There's no song called And Live With Me, Sarah. You, you gotta say the song. What, what one do you want me to do? That's one in a while, actually. Sarah? And, um, oh my 
Gordon. And Gordon Witch wants a Santa impression for. <laughs> Who's. Oh, Santa Claus. Never heard of him. I heard his name was. Fa Fa oh, Father Christmas? Do Father Christmas. too much. I'm doing too much. I, I, I was promised I'd press a single button and that was it. I just wanted to press a button. No wonder that was... <laughs> This is me red axe at night. Are you doing this to me? Oh, okay. Um, ho, ho, ho. Merry Christmas. Welcome to my Rhythm Doctor stream where the good ones on my list survive, and the naughty ones die. <laughs> I mean, ho 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 ho. And what's this young child who is probably tiny, who has posted a link on the chat? Uh, I got a uh, fucking. Uh, oh my god, David Hasselhoff, fucking true survivor. Fucking hell. Don't make me do this. Alright, I need, I need to listen to it. I need to listen to it to get me into the groove. Give me a second. I need- if I'm- if I'm to be a good rhythm doctor, then I need to listen- <laughs> I need to listen to True Survivor from Con Fury. Give me a moment. <laughs> what the fuck is going on tonight? Oh my fucking god. Oh. I do appreciate that, like, that's a true 80s era song too. That is an advert for AirPods. I can't hear. Oh shit, oh fuck. Alright. I need to get into the, the groove of it quickly. <laughs> oh, the keyboards! What is it with the 80s and the keyboards and the drum machines? <laughs> oh, yeah, DMC, you're right. I need to put it to my ear. I get DMCA'd. Alright. <laughs> Doppelganger, thank for the fuck. Pow! Just fucking threw my kazoo. As a reflex, pale. <laughs> oh God. Sarah, give me another song. Sarah, give me another song. <laughs> right, hang on. I've got like a stack of requests all of a fucking sudden. Give me a second. Um. All right. Um. Oh, I'm fuck! I'm not doing my fucking Father Christmas um, impression. <laughs> give me another one, uh, small child. Uh. I must comfort myself because I'm Santa Claus. Uh, Mrs. Claus bakes me some fine good cookies because I'm a fan. I'm a damn good father, daddy, father, father, dad. Uh, no, 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 okay, I'll do it for real. Uh, I must comfort myself. Uh, now, the best part about these is that. I actually cringe a little bit whenever I see it pop up on chat. It's it's that effective, and that's why it's so expensive, because my god does it absolutely fuck up my psych. Um... Um... I've... I've got a decent office. Actually, the office is looking pretty good. I've got some new lights going on. I've got a one-shot plays mouse pad. Um, it's, it's very white. 
I've got a nice little skylight so demons can look down on me whenever I sleep in my bed. Um, yeah, and I've got a, a shit ton of screens for all of our entertainment needs. I think I've done a pretty good job. Yeah, that counts as a compliment, doesn't it? That counts as a compliment. There you go, Dave. Thanks, man. <laughs> it's, it's people every time. Um, I, now, now I must. I, now, now I've got a fucking compliment myself again. Thanks to Pale. That's free compliments. I forgot to put a limit on that. Fuck. Well, you learn the hard way sometimes, don't you? Uh. Mike Oldfield Nuclear. I don't know that one. I actually don't know that one, Sarah. Getting taken head juggled by compliments. <laughs> I guess it's more one type of daddy. Um, uh, I can't think of any more compliments. This channel point aim is going to be made uh, redundant because I've run out of all things to say. Uh, not by Linkin Park. Wow, that's a departure from the other songs you just gave me. I can do that. Um, I don't know. I'd ask you guys to help me out, but then I might cringe even further, so maybe not. Uh, fuck, sorry, fix. What did I just say? <laughs> I just want to play my little rhythm game where I press a button. Uh... I'm a pussy. Sarah, I could fit you in my pussy if I had one. Uh... Compliments. Compliments. Ah. Uh... I got one. I got one. Right. How about a premeditated compliment? I'm pretty fucking decent at rhythm games. Oh. Oh. Oh, Joe, why'd you say that? Now you've cursed yourself. Now you've completely cursed yourself. I'm okay with your games. I'm not. I'm not. <laughs> Don't clip it. Don't clip it. That was just a delusion of grandeur talking there. Don't fucking clip that shit. I ran out of compliments, so I just said something that wasn't true. Does that count? Um, I haven't started the fucking... I haven't started the stream yet. Do with some... Ah, oh, fine. drink be right back
I'm back. Oh, sorry. My giant fat ass makes a really big sound whenever I sit down on my chair. I do apologize. God, how long until I completely kill this fucking sound effect? <laughs> we shall see. Alright, uh, I got another drink. I got a oh, oh! If John don't know, no one's gonna know, chat. No one knows. No one knows. I've got a beautiful cat. Does that count? Can I compliment someone else that means a lot to me? Can I say that you lot in the chat are fucking awesome and not me and uh, I'm really grateful for you lot for all being here right now and being with us for so long and loving our shit and sticking by and oh my god is it not fucking fulfilling the shit to make stuff for you and see your guys reactions and laughs and cries and swears and uh, fact checks on me and Ben not knowing shit because we're a fucking stupid uncultured Brits. Can I say that? Is that okay? No, 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 no. Okay, fine. All right, I'll take it all back then. Okay. Um. Uh. Oh. Uh, mm, I'm very good at cleaning. I'm a very good cleaner at the pool. I see some really terrible shit sometimes when I do clean, but god fucking damn, do I not clean that shit up? Oh yes, I do. I have. Ever, ever heard of human fat and human gunk? I didn't know it was a thing either until I stepped foot into that steam room and cleaned the shit out of it. But fuck me, am I good at cleaning the shit out of it? I'm very good at cleaning. I'm, I'm a great cleaner. I, I, I make things neat. I make things neat for, for Ben when he gets here. I make things neat for any guests that come visit the house. You know, I wash the floors, I wash the walls, I put everything away. I, I, I wash my armpits, I wash my feet, I wash everything, I wash my cat. I wash, I wash. <laughs> oh, boy, Neo, don't leave me, please. Don't leave me with these weirdos. Please help. Please come back. No, 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 no. There, you'll take it. You'll... Oh, sure, asking for the impossible. That's actually a very hard one. <laughs> like, it's actually super hard. If my mirror became sentient and felt lonely, would you cringe? No, because it's not the mirror's fault that it sees my horrible reflection in it. So I still give it a hug regardless, because I love the mirror. <laughs> Don't, don't, stop it. Don't do that anime thing where you say you believe in me and I can do it. Don't like that. Don't do that. Stop. Next thing you're going to start saying my name followed by ellipsis like a lot of people in Japan do. Don't do that. Don't do that. No, pale! No! Joey! Oh, no! Stop it! <laughs> <laughs> ah! <laughs> 
I'm good enough. I can do it. I can play this fucking game. I can do this shit. I can do it. Can I can I please play the game? <laughs> please. I'm playing the game. That's it. That's enough. Slot one. Let's do this. We're playing the game. Ah. Come back here. <laughs> I'm going to save some fucking people by pressing the button. All right. I'm all set. <laughs> You're set. You're good. You've had people uh, make you down drinks uh, and say things that aren't true about yourself, but you're all certain good to go to save other people's lives at least. You know, you're our first remote intern. We could really use to help. And thank you for the bit saver. <laughs> oh my god. I, I fucking I poured my can and a bit of beer missed my mouth. What is going on tonight? I actually uh, start of a game because the calibration took so long. Yeah, not my fault, Ian. Not my fault. I'm not alone, mate. As you can bloody hear, it's a ranked match, so I can't quit. All right, now I'm almost done. Your first patient's over there. Doctor Page can help you out. Ian, this was your job. By Page, I thought you meant um this guy down there. S sorry. What? Oh. Oh. Take your heart. Alright, you behind your computer. Hi, oh shit, you're talking to me. Our shift is really busy right now, so let's get right to it. We treat patients suffering from different chest pains and heart conditions. Can I apply? I've been going through a lot of symptoms throughout the start of the stream, please. <laughs> 40 minutes later, so fish. Is it? Oh my fucking Christ, it's 8 o'clock. What's that? What the fuck is going on? Let's do this shit. You treat patients by pressing your space bar on the 7th feet. 7th feet, okay. Got it. Listen to the music and press only on the 7th feet. Here we go. Here we go, chat. Perfect, keep going. Am I slamming it hard enough? Damn it! Should have eaten those baked beans. Great, you've got the hang of it. Congratulations! Looks like we're ready to move on. I lost my match though. We've got a lot of patience to treat, so let's get started. I didn't press rematch on the Giggle Gear result screen. Uh, press the spacebar to begin. What the fuck? Samurai? Uh oh. Banger alert? Alright, here we go. What the fuck? Holy shit, some psychedelic bullshit. This looks like a Celeste level almost. Ah! Ah! It's what? It's playing multiple beats. I don't like this. That was not seven. You lied. You lied to me, game. Ah! Fuck you. Got the last B one. B plus. B plus. I'll take it. Not bad for the first time. I'm satisfactory. Oh come on, Sass. That's more like a quote for like a C. Come on. B plus is like that's pretty good. Satisfactory. Fucking harsh ass samurai man. Nothing but perfection from these guys, I swear to god. You need to make sure you commit seppuku right through your fucking belly button. That's how you get the most amount of damage, and that's how you feel the most amount of shame. You did it. Whoa, it really works. I've got the rhythm in our bloodline, Nami. You're right, Tia. I went to space in level one. 
It'll be a huge help in getting to all these people. It's been crazy around here. Good job. Not a bad sense of rhythm either. That'd be perfect. Let's move on. We've got a new patient here today, an adolescent. Oh, the best kind. You can help him the same way. Be sure to check your page for some basic patient info. I draw it down here, admitted. All right, let's go. I'm gonna slam this fucker's heart. Oh, I'm gonna slam it so hard. Intimate, unplayed. Oh, I can um get a or better on day level. Oh, okay. It would appear that I've actually got to play good in order to unlock levels. Interesting. Mate, I was like one away from rank A. I didn't get that shit. I'm gonna get that shit. Put me back in, coach. I'm just gonna pay attention to uh, to the ripple. More than the beat. Side A and B side. What's that? What? What? A what? Plus. Fuck yeah! That's what. That's what it is. A for awesome power. I am a mace lure. There we go. Cool. All right, I'm getting the hang of it. Uh, intimate. One two. Your name is Logan. Uh, I already went to space. Uh, you put this game on your wish list. Yeah, it's been pretty decent so far. Say the wrong thing to her. My chest feels tired. Oh, the biggest adolescent problem: rejection. Oh, that will last until your entire life, son. Just you wait. But before we move on, some tips about a new. T oh God, new stuff. Variants. What have we got? This time you'll get a new kind of patient. Sometimes people come to us with this problem. And their heart skips a beat, so let's catch it while they're still in reach. When you see a red X in the line, that beat will be silent. Oh, that's fucked up, I don't like that. Just count the numbers in your head and hit on the center feet. Mate, this is like no commentary of the game. Like, I need to literally imagine the numbers in my head and count to it. That's gonna be hard. Nice! Okay, we're gonna mix up a little bit it seems. Next patient isn't even actually sick. He's just a massive loser. Hopefully you can snap him out of it. Well, good luck. Okay, here we go. New song. You gotta help me. My heart's not feeling too good and... Turn on my Sigma male inhibitors. Alright, here we go. This song sounds familiar. Thank you. 
Oh, patient is Oh, okay. There's a new, the new pet. What? 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 Oh no! Woman alert! Look out! She's gonna spread her cooties all over this poor patient. She's here too. I said something unrealistic is about to happen. Oh god! One at a time! One at a time! Fucking one at a time, people! Ah! Oh god! I did it. I sold the relationship with the power of slamming. A plus. Sweet. I must have completely uh, overlooked the fact that yeah, there's more than just one patient. <laughs> Even though I probably voiced it too. Great job, intern. Whoa, uh, hey Haley, I had no idea you were here too. Yeah, well, funny story. You said something about having to go to the hospital. You never texted back to explain why. So I kind of start freaking out, thinking you got sick. I got so worried my chest started to hurt, so my parents had me come here too. I didn't think it'd be so musical though. We're uh, experimenting with some new methods. When I heard that you were on this floor too, I wanted to come visit. Oh, cool. Uh, sorry. That last time we talked, I got flustered. I think I said something stupid. What I meant was... No worry about it. I used to have plenty of time to hang out while we're stuck here. You can tell me whatever was really on your mind, okay? That's uh, probably enough for now. Let's let Logan get his rest. Yeah, you guys have your sub- You guys have your sub story somewhere else. Right, oh, next! Next patient! I'm a practical learner chat. I don't like being told, I like being shown. So we haven't explained the whole musical doctrine process yet. We kind of pulled you straight into the deep end. Sorry about that. Thankfully, you're a quick learner. Ian, do you think you could explain the program? It's more your thing. Right. The Rhythm Doctor program is a new experimental healthcare initiative. If only it was real. It's a music-based cardiological treatment. By listening to the patient's heartbeat and synchronizing with it, we can calm the irregularities. It's quick and can save a lot of lives. It's Ben's fault. Ben rubs off on me and I become bad because of him. It's all Ben's fault. Plus, interns can perform the treatment remotely. And uh, that's foreshadowing for the next two week part, by the way. You guys are in for a treat. The short waiting times and less work part on the staff for those in a patron, you already know. Hey, hey. Love a sneaky little plug. It's a win win situation. That's the idea, at least. As long as it all goes well, we can... I need a drink anyway, I'm not drinking because there's ellipsis on the screen. Hmm. Hey, fuck cans. I'm gonna pull the rest of this into a glass. Oh god, the head's so big. Amateur mistake. Not a bartender confirmed. Mm. Hey, good plugs, Nick. Thank you kindly. Alright. Uh, who's next? Ian, did you finish setting up that remote connection? Yes, sir. As you can see, our new intern is here and... Very good. You go use your points, but I said all requests were used. Oh, whoo! Oh, oh, <sighs> thank God I took the initiative there, eh? God, could you imagine a stream of nothing but compliments? That'd be awful. God, well, there's always next time, please do, bro. There's always next time. Let's not be overconfident. There's still a lot of both of you should be getting to. You heard the ding when you heard the dots. The shift has only just started. 
ensure that every patient is personally seen to. I imagine I'm not interrupting some sort of break. That's okay, I can slam until the night ends. No, we would just submit a report about the program by the end of the day. Don't mind him. That's our... Well, don't worry about it. Okay. We should show you around so you can meet the rest of the patients. You should be able to shift your video display around the hospital too. Hold on. Something's happening. One of our patients needs help immediately. That can be good. Coleman only stream for 15k subs. You're up into- Oh my Christ! Uh, what? Wow! What? What is your affiliation, son? My god! Just stay calm and keep counting to seven. No matter what happens. Fuck me! He's a battle-worn insomniac! Oh my god, dude! You gotta play some Doom, that keeps away the, the, the sleep paralysis demon that night. He hates those songs from that game. Uh... If I had to describe it, I would describe One Shot Plays as a dangerous drinking game between a man with a lisp and a foot fetish. It's meant to provide the stone wreck of the dark depths of lost sanity. That is honestly a pretty good summary, my man. Thank you very much, Flo and Veen. I'll drink to that. Mmm. What's wrong with your face? What's happening? Oh, uh, this, this man brought a sword into the hospital. He's got chronic tiredness for the past seven years. No medicines have been effective. Rhythmic defibrillation. Advise. This sounds like something I can need for everyone in chat right now. Let's help him out. From a bunch of brothers to another. Press the space bar to begin. Here we go. Boss? You got bosses in this game? How's the volume, by the way? I am very much loving these graphics, though. I'm just not going to pay attention to the health bar up there. I play fun games and lag, you can't stop me. <laughs> oh my god. RPG Maker. The song. The Wi Fi signal champ. <laughs> oh wow, they know. Cheeky. Connected. <laughs> Make a note of that chat. We're gonna say that every single time we play Smash. It's about to come back now and stronger. The most important form. <laughs> this is a song Monica has sex to. Fuck. Wow, it's fucked. Holy shit. I do good. Oh shit, some interface screw. Oh wow. I was not expecting that kind of shit in a rhythm game. Cool. Holy shit, that was act one. Mate. Look forward to playing the rest of this game. Shit. The stream buffered for you guys. Oh, that's cute. I like that. This is getting way too meta. 
His heartbeat got really erratic, but it looks like you had it under control. Ian, what was all that? Is that supposed to happen? No, that strange virus was disrupting the intern's signal. It was even messing with the cardiogram. Should be fixed now, but I'll look into it. Just a small hiccup in the process. Hope it doesn't persist. This is a hospital, not a fucking Mackie D's. Christ, fix your connection, guys. Let's move on for now. Got it. Looks like we're done with this set of patients. Let's move on to the next ward. Oh shit, we got a bunch of wards waiting. Okay, let's do this then. I don't agree on the boss. Fair enough. There's... There's more levels. Oh shit, you can swap between techno and dubstep. Hold the fuck on. Hold the fuck... Hold on. You can actually play some remixes of songs. That's awesome. He looks pretty... He looks pretty exhausted. Should we give it a go? Patient chest pain has returned. He reports experience in carpal hallucination hearing heavy bass drops. Oh no, base of the Titans has infected this poor man. We must help him. We can't let him be subjected to the worst song in Valhalla. That's just not fair. Alright, let's do this. He's moving his head very fast, that concerns me. Oh. Uh. Determination! Oh! These visuals though! Oh! If you've got bad case of epilepsy, uh, here's your warning. <laughs> ah! 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 I think I'm doing six. I need to do seven. Fuck. Wow. Wow, these visuals are absurd, though. Wow. C plus. Wow, they're, they're dicking about it a lot, and I'm liking the results. I was not feeling the wob wob at all. Not enough guitars for me. Holy shit. Oh, Ray. Hello, Ray. Welcome to the chat. Is, your, is actually your first time in chat? Wow, I had no idea it was your first time on a stream, Ray. Well, welcome. Good to see you live. How you doing, my man? Or girl? Person, good to see you in the chat. Have a good day, Ray, wherever you are. It's super cool. I actually want to see it again. I actually want to see if I can get a B at least. That was pretty cool. Plus, it's good practice for future levels too. It's pretty cool. I like how not only does the music change, but the visuals literally get like super in your face all of a sudden too. This Minecraft level. I was not expecting this from my single button game.
Yeah. All right. I'm expecting songs to like maybe mess up the sequence as it goes to seven, just to throw you off a little bit. I can see that being like a mechanic later on. But yeah, we're getting some good practice here. Great work. Yeah, they go really ham with the visuals here. I feel like that's actually like a really good way to also make the game like look good compared to other rhythm games, but also use that like, this game utilizes it as a mechanic as well, which is really cool. That's what I kind of really like about it right now. Operations are usually tougher. Come back to these patients when you're up for a challenge. Alright, shall we uh, move on to the next ward? Yeah, let's go. Oh yeah, turn the lights on. Always a guitar man. Uh, Lo-fi hip-hop beats to treat patients to. It's pretty neat that each level is its own genre too. At least that's the impression I'm getting from all of this. I read that as SMT Eurythm, but I've <laughs> I almost busted my nut live on stream, but it's okay, I, I, I can't, I've calmed down, don't worry. <laughs> of course I'm not. Oh, that's, that's, I'm assuming that's what the OST selection is for. Um, patient is a young musician suffering from supraventricular ta ta tachycardia, administer the 2BSVT rhythm treatment. My brain's did a big ol' <laughs> Ready for something new? Now we're in the supraventricular tachycardia ward. <laughs> One more called projected. Can you actually, I saw the option OST on YouTube, can you actually go and do that with this game? Because if so, that is absurdly awesome and you will not see it because DMCA is a bitch, but man is that not a cool fucking selection to have. You can actually do it. Oh, it's so good, that's awesome. Patients here have two beats instead of seven. The nurse will cue you and the phrase ready, set, go. You can't just do that with anyone though, surely. Like, they, they've got to be pre-made for every song you select from YouTube, or does it do it automatically? Because if it does it automatically, that's that could be pretty impressive. Mm. <coughs> oh, the nurse will cue you in with the phrase, ready, set, go. Ahead. She's picked up English now. I remember her rhythm. They get quite crazy. Here, Ian will demonstrate first. Ready, hey, Ian, how's it going? Set, go. What? Oh. Okay. I'm waiting for the song where it just mixes and all the mechanics into one song. That's my turn. Ready, uh, Good. And stop. Great, I'm getting the hang of it. Let's move on. For SVT beats, it doesn't matter when the beat pauses. Don't be tricked. Just always follow the nurse's get and set timing. You need the beat pulses multiple times or pulses on an off beat. Just stick to the get and set timing. These funky SVT beats will normally happen without warning, but for the lesson we will deploy a spider to induce him. Hey! Spiders, the friendliest creature in the Buck Kingdom. Everyone loves spiders. Oh, don't worry. This is a completely controlled environment, and it's a medically trained professional spider. Now come out, Black Widow. Before we do this, do spiders bother you? If you do not want to see a spider on the screen, press the button twice. That's cute that they actually think of people who got arachnophobia. Are you okay you're seeing a spider? Well, chat, this is for you. Do you guys want to see the spider or fuck that shit? Oh. <laughs> it paused! I didn't press anything! I'm sorry. Get set. Don't worry, it's a pixelate spider. 
Your first FUT patient will need to be treated just like that. Oh my god, keep that beat in your head and good luck. Okay. Mmm. 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 Alright, so I've got to do the beat of a grappler character. I can do that, that's fine. Slow but beefy hits. Slow but beefy hits. And then suddenly, 720, come on, grab, bah, I win! Okay, I won't jump that too soon. Alright. Ready, D, get it, set it, go! It's very relaxing. Didn't even look at the screen. Didn't even look at the screen. Eyes closed. All right, here we go. I will try. What? Oh, oh. Set. Go. That's very distracting. Damn it, people ruined my shit. Fucking yeah. no way. Try to practice my Sigma male grind set here, and you got friends coming in doing their shit too? No way. 10 hour study beats. All right, supraventricular tachycardia. Let's give it a go. Patient risks increase super veg due to high caffeine diet. Continue to observe closely. All right. Hello, Ian. People probably can do this with their eyes closed just because it's just a beat. You've got to follow more of anything. You don't really have to look at the screen. So uh, if some weird wacky bullshits happen on the screen, just go Daredevil and just absolutely cream it. Honestly, if Daredevil were playing, if, if Matt if Matt Mercer was actually playing this game, he would absolutely flex super hard and wreck this game. But someone would have to read him what the actual descriptions are to the poor guy. <laughs> Dark Souls of a blender. <laughs> what? They just shot their control into it? Look at the screen is more of a flex. Welcome to the Salty Spittoon. How tough are you? I be Rhythm Doctor. Yes, so what? Whoa, looking at the screen. Oh, right this way, sir. Now you should learn how to deal with attacks. When SVT patients have attacks, their heart rate doubles. Oh, fuck. And when their heart settles, it halves. <laughs> the nurse will see changes coming. And she will warn you with a faster cue or slower cue. Thanks, nurse. Just follow the rhythm established by her get and set calls. Okay. I've got to listen to what she says. Ah! Ah! Oh, we're losing him, Doctor! 
Coming down. Hold him down. Hold him down. Hold him down, nurse. Hold him down. Oh, okay, that was close. That was close. All right. All right. Okay. Oh, nothing restraints don't fix. Call you a little bit off guard. A little bit. Don't worry. Let's try that again. Yes, please. Pay close attention to the nurse. Okay. So fast. Get sent go. Ah! Get sent go. Wow, ah, what the fuck? Get sent go. And stop. <laughs> yes, please. Can I, can I practice that again, please? That patient call keeps drinking coffee lately. Now he's experiencing caffeine-induced attacks. You just need to keep him stabilized. That's what espresso does to a motherfucker. Wait, no. Wait, wait, I want to practice again. What are you doing? Oh, God. Well, here we go, chat. Time to not up or shut up. Look what I have learned. I'm going to save this man. Get. Set. You didn't tell me about faster ones. A what the fuck? <laughs> Jesus Christ. Wow, how calm. Yeah, that was me calm. That was totally calm for the whole entire thing. Super good. Easy. Piece of piss. GG! <laughs> I was not expecting to go faster than the tutorial. This, game's, this game's got some cheek to it, man. All right, good. Stable again. Listen, I promise everything will be okay. If you really drink this much coffee per day for the sake of your music, maybe there's something deeper going on. Try to think of other things that can inspire you. I can actually click to, to do it. I won't do that, I'll stick to spacebar. I imagine that you guys in chat prefer the meaty splatter of a spacebar as I scream my arse all out. You can find something that should weaken the dependency. Ultra River Instinct. <laughs> It's not easy, but fine, I'll try. As long as I shut the fuck up, I'll be good at a game. This is why LP tax is a thing, guys, because you've got to commentate and play a game at the same time. Whew, good work with the defibrillation. This river method helps with symptoms, but I wonder if we can retreat really addiction. I wonder if Life Guys inspired this game. Because we all know the song that you go to the beat to when you do CPR, don't we? We usually need to tackle the issue at its root, it's complicated. The Sigma keyboard over the beta controller is a okay. Speaking of addiction, there's another patient we should check in on. She's actually on shift, so let's go visit. Hey, it's that girl from Stone Ocean who I see in the intro, but I don't know the name of. 
puff piece. Okay. The barista at the hospital cafe is experiencing SVT type symptoms, maybe tired to frustration, administered treatment during rush hour. Have you considered maybe not selling coffee? And maybe swip into tea instead? Our next patient is exhibiting a new type of SVT. Oh, it's always a new one with you guys, isn't it? They got a dump a song on me where it's every single beat. I can see it coming. Interestingly enough, SVT beats can swing. Listen to the nurse's cue to get a feel for how the swung rhythm is different than the classic one. All right, you're up. Lights, camera, action. Do you like jazz, Jeff? Okay, awesome. You're getting the hang of it. Time for phase two. Phase two will have it. I like Persona. <laughs> we'll have you alternate between normal and swung SVT rhythms on the fly. Get ready. Never see it coming is totally gonna. Not a surprise, I mean, it's definitely gonna be a fucking song on this. Get set. Isn't the first beat? Get set, go. D, get set, go. Get there we go. Set, go. D, get set, go. Stop. Fucking bring it. The fuck you got? You've got it down. Our next patient is Nicole. She works as a barista in the hospital's cafe. Her heart is exhibiting this swung variation of SVT rhythms. Good luck. Oh man, all these poor coffee addicts. Drink milk instead, it's better for you. And your bones. In fact, fuck all that and drink orange juice. For space bar to begin. Alright, here we go. Get set. Do a song? I feel like yeah. head banging is a necessity to play this game. Ah! Let's try. Ah! And stop. A plus. Hey! Employee of the year! That was a fun little one. Yeah, I'm I'm lit you can't see me, but I'm literally like bopping my head and moving to the side as I do this. It actually helps quite a fair bit. Gotta feel the funky rhythm of just like a real doctor does when they're saving people's lives. Thanks to the save back there. Hey, welcome, Nicole. Sounds like you got a long and grueling job. But it's a pretty nice place, though. I actually really love the design of that coffee shop. I noticed that. I know, I know. The smoking. I promised I would stop. Is that even legal to do in here? 
It's the only thing that gets me through these absolute hell shifts. It calms me down. Are you interested in quitting? I can help you if you want. I've tried before, but if you have any tips, that'd be great. Just slather yourself in patches and you'll be fine. I understand completely. I can help. We can work on it together. Oh, by the way, this is our new intern. The one behind the screen. Hello! Alright, Nicole! How's it going? It's on your phase, Nami. I think it's one of my phases as well, too. The more, I mean, the more Persona like it is, the more I like it, probably. But I like, it's funny. I like a bit of rock, I like metal. I love a bit of jazz, though, as well. And I'm admittedly a little bit of a Taste fan. <laughs> oh, we go either way sometimes. Thanks, that's good to know. You two might be the only cool people around here. That Ian guy always has his nose in his laptop. Most high schoolers just whisper and giggle at each other. And the other doctor dude scares me. Or at least, the guy in the red hoodie is pretty chill. He actually talks to me. Something to look forward to every day. Sorry, I'm rambling. Thanks for the save, dog. Come back if you ever need a coffee. Or just want to hang. Okay. Oh, we just did this one. Uh, two, four, Song of the Sea. It's just a carton of cigarettes. I want this song to be nothing but coughing. Cafe is available for all star during the workday. For to relax and spend time at our in house barista. I guess on deep lore. Your favour's yet to come. Okay, here we go. Welcome. Take a seat. Uh, you're probably sitting already. Nah, no, I'm, I'm handstanding, girl. This is how I play my rhythm games. Rush hours though, so things should be a little bit more. Oh god, it's automatic. Okay. Make yourself comfortable. There's a dusty keyboard over there. Maybe you can tour around a bit. I'm a harmonica kind of guy, I'm afraid. Oh, look who it is. Hey, I'll get my usual. Look at me. I'm an 80s musician. You're never the same when you've touched my finger. Actually, try and go for like, the beat for this song here right now. <laughs> sorry, 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 sorry. Very well timed beats turn me on. I do apologize. Oh. Sorry, I'm just listening to these people talk, don't mind me. Stallone is in here. There's fucking weirdos in that bubble tea. Chat, is this important? Do I do I have to listen to this? Is this important law? Or can I just skip this and keep playing the game? Is 
It's important. Oh, all right. <clears throat> Play it again, barista guitar. I need the break for what's to come. It's not important at all. Is it actually not important? I don't mind listening to these people talk, but I do want to keep playing rhythm games too. You know what, chat, I'll leave it to you. What shall I do? Shall I keep on listening to this? Or shall I keep on playing some Robin games? Ending now. That's cute. My, I've, I got ranked for that. Good job. <laughs> what? What? Hang on, that's a that's gotta be a fake ranking. <laughs> Surely I don't get anything from that at all. Well done. Yeah, I uh, I, I totally knocked that out of the park. <laughs> what? So that's two of our main SVT patients having episodes in one day. I'm so good at this game! Uh, I don't want it all. Oh, the um Oh you're doing a poll? Nice one. And both relapse into the very habits causing it so much for self-control. Look, it's nothing wrong with indulging like the little sins in life, okay? It gets us by, you only live once after all. To be fair, you can't just kick a habit overnight. <laughs> my room name's my room game's kinda nice. We should check in on them one more time before our shift is over. You need to go find Cole. You need to and I will check on the barista. Alright. Hey dudes. Just checking in. How are you feeling? Okay, for now, my shift's almost over. I will take any more smoke breaks, but it's tough. I had to stay numb during work. Coffee people are so impatient. Yeah, they fucking are. I bet everyone's got a coffee story to tell. Have you been able to take your mind off of it? Does anything help? <laughs> Thank you, Irish. Oh, I appreciate the pep talk, my man. Actually, that red hoodie guy sent me a song he made once, and now that song stuck in my head. A tactical nuke in a rhythm game does sound pretty interesting, though. So, in a way, I guess that earworm sort of helps time go by. Honestly, if every customer could be more like that dude, each day would be a lot easier. My chest, not feeling great. Oh, it'll be okay. The internal will help. Are you ready? Stay focused on the beat, no matter what. Boss time. All right, here we go. Oh shit. Oh, okay. Prepare for some glitches. The musician and barista experiencing a high-end SVT episode. Keep steady with your two-beat treatment, no matter what. Okay. What the fuck? What? Uh, I'd like to point out that I'm on game capture, not display capture. Should I put it on display capture? I think I should put it on display capture. Hang on, give me a second, ladies and gents. Uh, we'll have it on the Steam homepage because I, I, I think this is for Mac for certain reasons. There we go. Yeah, that's exactly it. This is exactly how I see it. Okay, I'm expecting some shit. <laughs> okay, okay. Right. Okay. Are you folks at home ready for whatever the fuck is about to transpire? Okay. 
We're gonna do it. Here we go. It's just throwing me off here. I pause a lot of updates. Ain't nobody got time for that. Get sent. Go. I just can't refrain. So One more shot never again. All the excuses. Always the same. Oh! Oh my god! My double monitor! Come back! Wait! <laughs> I'm on dual screen setup! It's. Ah! Wait! <laughs> it's going for both the screens! What are you doing? <laughs> oh my god! It's blocking the chat! I can't see the chat! Is this supposed to do that? Ah! Whoa! Whoa! <laughs> oh my god! It's actually gone for you guys! Wow! Oh my god! This is so cool but also really trippy at the same time! Oh, video games are so cool! <laughs> oh, that's so trippy! It's gone to my second monitor. This is awesome. And there it is. Sorry, guys. You can only see the first monitor. I'm seeing all this cool shit right now. And this is awesome. Holy shit. Wow. to realize the truth. You have been through all the things I've been through. You can be my muse. Ready, get set, go. I'm shaking, scared, awaken. Taking this pain to realize the truth. So take the craving. Take away the Ready, get set, go. No, come back! Listen to me! My PC is rebelling against me, help! <laughs> oh, holy shit. I was not expecting that sort of visual fuckery from my desktop. This game's crazy. I'm about to full screen. Wow! Holy fuck! <laughs> That was really cool. Jesus Christ. I wasn't expecting the window to shrink and bounce about. And the fact that it it, it goes around your entire setup too. Like, because it was going from the left screen to my right screen as well. It was going back and forth. That was nutty. Mate. Holy fuck, that was boss two. My bosses are in this game. Oh, there's like 50. Oh my god. That was crazy. Yeah, that was crazy, Cole. Imagine that in custom maps. Oh my fucking Christ. Yeah, oh god. Could imagine like doing like Undertale or like Amori songs or whatever. Or like one-shot songs and it starts bouncing about like fucking with your interface. That shit's so cool. Oh my god. 
it minimized and I thought, wait a minute, I can't full screen it. Is this part of the game? And lo and behold it was, that was well cool. I can lock it to one screen, but fuck that shit, I'm keeping it to two, that was awesome. This thing to bounce about like a bloody widescreen double monitor. <laughs> that was well cool. Holy fuck. That was well cool. Oh man. My heart's gonna jump out my chest. Same, haha. So that's why you DM'd me about that, Neon. That's why. Because when you messaged me that, I was just like, well, yeah, I go between game capture and display capture sometimes. I didn't, like, I just thought, like, maybe people didn't know that's what I did. But lo and behold, that was why. That was why. That was well cool. You're able to treat them both at once. Perfect. Because my setup's pretty big as well, I was actually like moving my head back and forth at some points. Oh, a dock is here. I guess I probably gotta go back to my room, haha. <laughs> but uh, maybe I could hang out here just a little longer. While well, Nicole closes up. Go up with some decaf room. Promise. Fair enough, you're not in trouble or anything. What do I sound like a school teacher? You know, Doc, I don't think you guys should worry about me. That thing you said about finding inspiration to keep making music. I think I can do it. Without the caffeine. It's great news. Habits are tough to change, but having someone to cheer you on always helps. I mean, I literally live off espresso whenever I wake up in the morning for an early lifeguard shift. And uh, if someone who I knew who was close to me just told me to stop them, like... It's funny how motivation comes to you from other people more than yourself sometimes. Finally, Cole. There you are. Oh yeah, I can't give him that slip, huh? You alright, Ian? Yeah, I was running as fast as I could to tell you that virus connectifia abortus was detected again, this time in Cole and the barista. So the boss fights fuck with your interface. That's pretty cool. That's cool because it feels like an actual virus. Like a computer virus virus as well. Like a different kind of virus. I was rushing to find you, but uh, it, it looks like you already handled it. Good, I guess. Very punctual. Anyway, these two seem to be feeling much better. We'll check in on them tomorrow. When we are ready, let's head back to the main ward. Woo! Okay, main ward, yeah? Yeah, honestly, the only time I drink coffee is 5am in the morning when I've got to get off my morning shift. Other than that, I never, ever, ever, ever drink it. It's literally just for that espresso kick before I wake up for my lifeguard shift. That's the only time I have it. Well, unless you go to like a coffee shop or someone, then just get, you know, you know a latte or whatever. But yeah, it's always been espresso for me to wake up. I know one shot likes to do stuff like that. When I played that game for like uh, an hour, I should get back on that game, by the way, because I've been meaning to, because it seems like a pretty interesting one. But I remember one shot doing shit like that too, which is pretty cool. We've checked in on Logan, Haley, Cole, Nicole, and the two guys with the swords. <laughs> Wow, that's quite a description of people in your hospital. There's a few more patients for you to meet, and then we can see if the rhythm doctor treatments are enough to get them home. Ah, they, they said the title of the thing. Thankfully, this new method is helping speed things along. Oh, Dr. Edgar is coming. Please don't let me interrupt your important meeting. Go on. We were done. We're just moving on. We haven't checked on Mr. Stevenson yet. Seems to take you to a while to walk down a hallway these days. Regardless, I'm only making my way over here to update you on our staffing. As you're both aware, we've had several staff members quit in the past few months. A shame how some people buckle under the lightest of pressure, abandoning us. That feeble doctor and several nurses, remember? We are planning to have these positions filled in with the new staff by now. Plans have changed. To save budget and time, we're leaving these positions vacant permanently. What? Hospital this size can't be run by... We pivot into this to a Doctor program to make up for the reduced staff. 
You've proven how effective this new method is. This guy's definitely the protagonist. Yeah, he's 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 most definitely the good guy in this story. Skeleton crew should be sufficient to carry it out. Oh yeah, definitely. Crunch. Crunch away and add it to the heave. Dr. Page will be in charge of giving every patient their individualized attention and checkups. Ian will be in charge of facilitating this intern and any new ones you can find in these ribbon-based operations. As he price, make sure there are no more bugs in the program. Understood? Our hospital always needs to keep up with the changing times. I trust that you will keep up too. Oh man. Bad fucking vibes. Overwork your staff. Sorry, Ada. Yeah, it's a good time to you. I actually didn't know you were streaming it also. I'm just playing it as a one-off now, but maybe I'll play some more in the future, who knows. This guy wants to work for Shinra Health Pack Care Plan. The true antagonist, management, yep. Oh yes. It's fine, I can handle it. Crunch culture is always fucking bad. Uh, hire people, give people jobs, pay them. It's easier for the staff, it's easier for everyone, it's easier for the organization. Management, it's down to you. Stop being dickheads. Hire some lifeguards, please. Because my January is not looking so great. <laughs> Thank you. I've still got some work to do. I'll be watching over my mother while I'm home, but hopefully I can make time to fix bugs. Good luck, both of you. I'll get back as soon as I can, I promise. Thanks, Ian. I appreciate it. Try to enjoy the break. Well, at least just us. Cries in real life healthcare. Ah, Not in Britain where it's free, unfortunately. I'm joking. They work pretty damn hard over there. Over there down there. Oh, I need to keep tabs on Cole and Nicole's addiction rehab. I need to check in on Mr. Stevenson. Oh no, did someone bring a pet in here or something? I don't have time for this. Can you follow that trail of feathers and figure out where it's coming from? Is that fucking duck? Some other things need to handle. Especially with Dr. Edgar always keeping his army. You're a lifesaver. I'll still go back over you afterward. Your brother works in healthcare and yeah. Oh mate. Honestly, you've got to do everyone working in healthcare right now in the hospitals. Especially during these times because shit is tough. These are tough times, dude. Uh, the sleepy garden. Alright. Cockatiel. Logan. Haley. Is that someone in a chicken costume? Oh, no, it's an actual chicken. Some sort of bird has been spotted in the halls. Some other patients have been following it, so keep an eye on them. Quit? Yeah, like, you're just one of those sort of... I've seen it before in real life where you've got these, like, uh, um... They're like TV screens, like monitors on like these moving sort of like stands with like wheels and like people can control them outside. I've seen that before when I used to work in, um, oh, when I was a runner for certain graphic design places. <laughs> it's kind of like that really. Like I imagine you're just like a robot holding like a monitor or some shit and your face is coming through it. Press the space bar to begin. Ah, piano. I love pianos. Oh. Hey, Haley. Come quick. I found it. What are you doing here, little guy? Oh, fuck. All right, here we go.
fuck was that an A plus? <laughs> I feel like I'm really dicked up at the end there. I'm a stoic bonsai tree somehow. That felt like a V to me. I don't know about that game. Thank you very much, though. Oh, I'm back. I know there's something strange. Logan's heart has shown strain and irregularity again. Apocalyptic! That's a DMZ reference. So, we're back to square one. I thought we would be ready for discharge by now. Uh, Yeebo, thank you for the follow. I hate you that I passed the first attempt. Oh, it, that was a roadblock for you, was it, Tia? Oh, man. But, but rhythm's in the blood. We know what they say, the youngest ones are always the ones with the stronger genes, right? We're the ones to succeed. It's okay, Tia, don't worry. I'm here to avenge you. Maybe you should drink more during streams. It helps sometimes. The game can only render one line, so sometimes double notice will look like he missed, but he didn't. Oh, really? That's interesting. Something happened between Logan and Haley while I was gone. The fuck, how many points have you fucking got? Are you redeeming them or have you actually got that many? <laughs> uh, okay, fine. I got it. My, 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 my family is amazing, especially my Tia. Bam. Anything you notice that explains why his heart is pounding. Does that count? Right, you can't say anything. Can't talk through the screen. Never mind. And you should check back in uh, on Logan again. Stabilize his heartbeat. That samurai guy too, he needs a check up. Cheating? Oh, come on. I'm complimenting my bloodline here. I can't compliment my super attractive, awesome, and artistically talented bloodline? What are you saying? How are you fund those points? <laughs> Me and only me. Shit. Okay. Uh, my. <sighs> Fuck. Okay. Hmm. Um. I've. I've honestly got a great fucking taste in in. No. <laughs> no! It sounded a lot better in my head. No, okay, no, no, hold, no, forget that thought, okay. Um. Um. Okay, fine, do you know what? Uh, let's talk about something that I'm doing recently that I'm trying to get a hold of right now. Okay. I am a. I'm a decent driver. I've got the potential to be a great driver on a road for the fucking idiots. My god, they're stupid sometimes. Don't fucking put out on me uh, on the left on a roundabout, you dickhead. Because I'm coming through and I'm the one who matters. There, does that count Irish? If you say that counts, I'll tell you what I was about to say. It counts for you. All right, fine. I was about to say I've got a great taste in women. <laughs> but I thought, actually, you know what? That might sound a little bit presumptuous. Maybe I shouldn't. <laughs> but I, I didn't. Therefore, I never said it. I never told you right now. That counts. That counts. That counts. <laughs> nice. He should check back in on Logan again to stabilize his heartbeat. That samurai guy too. He needs a checkup. While you do that, I was going to help treat our only patient, Mr. Stevenson, but... No. <laughs> <laughs> it looks like a new patient was just admitted. Let's see how we can help him. It looks like Donald Trump with a tail. Let's help him. Richard Hugh, Logan Samurai. Oh, he's already complaining like a true politician. Sorry, this patient just barged into the hospital without filling out any forms. He seems to be in a rush. Let's see what he needs. Oh, uh, what do you need, man in tie? He's probably very pushy and upper class. Is he going to turn into a great ape if I fuck this up? So we've got a senior citizen requiring care. Oh, just let him die. Don't fucking care. <laughs> but now apparently there's a politician here who demands to be treated first. Oh. Oh, yeah, that too. <laughs> uh, hey, you know, this is like straight out of our textbooks. What framework do we use to decide who to treat first? 
Under a fair and egalitarian RHS, what do we do? Uh, Ian, we started as barely a year ago. A whole medical ethics course, remember? Remember your hippopotamus oath? We did? Oh, yeah. Yeah, that ethics course. I didn't know that applied to real life. Okay, okay, I remember now. QAOY. Right, quality adjusted life years. Yep, exactly. How does it work? It's like a formula to calculate the value of people's lives. And the one who has the higher number wins, right? So between these two patients, there's Q8, there's, there's Quaddy, whatever. Include political power as a factor? No, Ian, it does not. Well, we're going to treat him. We'll slash our funding next year. Case closed. The politician wins. Sorry, Grams. Wow. Oh, no. Oh, what the fuck? You made Tom cry. Tom, um, what's his name? I can't remember his name now. Uh, he's dressed exactly like that character, and he's an RF. He's in a lot of storybooks. I can't remember his fucking name. Tom something or other. Can't remember his name. Sawyer. Tom Sawyer. Thank, thank you, Lazarine. Yeah, he looks like Tom Sawyer a little bit. You leave off Tom Sawyer, Trump. Come back, your greatest tutorials. Uh oh. You, how dare he share my name? Mm-mm, mm-mm, bah. Bah. Great job, intern. Look, he's got two X's on his ECG. Why is his heart skipping so much? Is he feeling overwhelmed lately? What was that? Me overwhelmed? I do not want to see what my one is, in all honesty. Mine's, mine's probably like that, but... Split into eight different directions, and the X's are just plastered on the screen. Oh, and the window's minimized. And it gets bigger and bigger, and, and it shrinks every single time. That'd be my one. That's how chaotic my hobby is. How dare you? You wasted too much of my time. I've got an important speech to give that I'm 100% not nervous about, and I need the best possible medical care. If you fancy med grads want to still have your job tomorrow, you better come treat me, am I righty? You do realize we've got control over your life, sir. Shifts more care. Don't even think about it, fur boy. No. Wow, I got 
half near the end. And god, literally hey, all of these songs are like a minute and a half long. Oh shit, does that mean if people want to listen to these songs like online or on Spotify or some shit? They're literally only a minute and a half tracks. Nah, there must be full versions. There's gotta be. These songs are a jam. They can't just last for like a minute and a half, surely. Hmm. Oh. Honestly, it's pretty cool how much they're mixing up the gameplay of this game where it's just one button to get the beat. That's pretty cool. That seemed to work well enough. Good job. Oh no, he's back. Here we go. People have extended short pieces. Oh cool, yeah, extensions are always good. Oh, so there's no full, there's no like, um, full versions, quote unquote, people just extended them. That's fair enough. Still, it's better than nothing. What is the meaning of this? Step away for one second, and you think you can get away with some shabby long distance treatment on me? Ridiculous. Disrespectful. I came here for the highest quality doctor's personalized care. Whatever happened to that? You. The disheveled looking dropout behind the screen thingy. Oh, excuse me, have you seen my Virgil-esque hair? That is not disheveled, boy. That is sleek and full of motivation, my man. I demand to know who you are. I'm the one who's in control of your life. I'm the one who can press a button and literally crash his entire game if I wanted to. I'm reporting you to your superiors. What's your name? Ah! This is what I'm talking about. Think you can ignore me when I'm talking to you? No manners around here. Do you know who I am? I'm Richard Hugh. I'm the nation's bloody health secretary. I'm trying to pass off my delicate operation to some intern in their basement. <laughs> wow, how dare you? Just wait until I turn the cable networks. If I'm not mistaken, wasn't your party completely okay with this whole rhythm doctor initiative? Details, details. When I signed off on that, I didn't think I would get stuck with one of these bargain bin interns. I can't stay here. This place is musty and smells like shellfish. Who oh, talk about it. It smells fine in here. I can't wait to have a phone call with your supervisor. Good day. Well, that was something. Anyway, back to our jobs. There's an elderly gentleman who needs me, Mr. Stevenson. He keeps dozing off, so I haven't been able to speak with him yet. He's experiencing some heart block. I'll take care of it and get his x-rays done. There's a new patient here too. I haven't met them. Can you hand it for me? Yes, please. Let's split up. You take the politician, please. Thank you kindly. Uh, the distant duet. Elderly patient's heart rate has been detected as an evening. Treat carefully and answer any questions you may have. Dear, could you help me? I took a fool of my heart. Was a oh shit. You took a fool? Right this way. A huge mistake. Hey. You like this next one? Don't say do it here. Could the intern read a fire will or kill snake at will? Don't think so. Exactly. Hi snake, go die. Before we move on, there's another condition we've been noticing. I know that my elderly patient, Mr. Stevenson, has this type of rhythm, so you'll probably come across it. Open the fire gates. This treatment is for patients with heart block. Their heartbeats are regularly irregular. Because the heart signals aren't working properly, the beat comes out with this uneven feel. Oh, they won't pulse out at a regular interval, like what you've been used to. Okay, I think of it almost like swing music, huh? And hit them on the seventh beat. As long as it's the seventh beat, I'm good. Uh, uh, easy. Let's try a case where the seventh lands and a blocked beat, okay? Okay. Oh fuck! I turned Tom into a zombie. A vine boom too. Let's go over a trickier type of hard block. 
The nurse will play some piano to help you. Oh good, piano calms me down. Did you know she used to be a musician? Now for this next case, we're split enough to deal with multiple patients. Don't worry, I'm handling my patient, Mr. Stevenson, myself. You're handling one of our newer patients. If you encounter any of these swung rhythms, you'll be ready. Good luck, see you on the other side. Man, don't say that in the hospital. Okay. Let's do it. She's doing well. Why is this already my favorite track? Piano just gets me. Oh, that got a bit hairy at the end there. Come on, man. I feel bad when the heart explodes and whatever the fuck is in there comes out. Hello. I'm only a finger. There we go. my favorite song so far pianos and guitars are like a, a pretty great combination oh man oh looks like a chicken oh no worries day's paradise see you later got a scoop for the night the song is beautiful and you're great oh thanks man you're great too thanks for stopping by man hope you have a fantastic night dude thank you for stopping by Oh, you hard as he used it. That pretty, I catch it. Oh, it's your favorite too, Tia? Of course it is. Good taste runs in the family, after all. <laughs> I'm back. Honestly, like, pianos, I'm just a sucker for pianos. Pianos uh, and, like, um, a solemn guitar riff. And the combination of the two, it just always wins me over. Always works. 
Um, one track I can think of from the top of my head is uh, Battle for Everyone's Souls in Episode 3. I think that's still up there as one of my favorite final boss themes ever. It's a real good one. Just because it's not only is it a reprise of Velvet Room, but like it's got the guitars and the piano and it utilizes both instruments really well for that final confrontation. So from the top of my head, yeah, Battle for Everyone's Souls is a proper good track. Like that's a good example of a good piano and guitar track. Anyway, well done Paige, you're back. You did way better than I did by the looks of things. Because yours was easier. This shift is kidding me. I feel like I'm running on an empty tank and... Last nervously and still need to finish P3. <laughs> There's some rumors going on, but bear in mind that they're just rumors and nothing more and nothing less. But we'll see. But that's okay. We got Persona 4 Arena on Steam, which means we don't need any more Persona news until pre years, I'd say. Otherwise, that's a bit sport for us, isn't it? If we keep begging for more Persona news after we've got Persona 4 Arena on Steam with rollback, don't you think? I think so. I miss when we had a full staff around here. Oh, my chest isn't feeling so hot. This is the part where Ian usually urges me to take a break. I can't afford it today. I'll drink some water and keep pushing. Hey, actually, I need a favor from you. Or oh, the normal boss theme from P4. Yeah, that's a good one. Can you keep an eye on my heart rate? Oh, are you doing all right? I'll be fine, I think. It's just as a backup, you know? In case I fucking die all of a sudden, which hopefully will not happen. Ian should be back soon. We just need to hold out until that. Here comes the nurse. She's holding her phone. SMT6 before P6. Well, the popularity that SMT5 has, hopefully. I'm not holding my breath for it, though. Definitely not. In fact, uh, honestly, after a fifth mainline game has finally been released, I can wait for five fucking years, man. It's fine. And I've never had such shoddy treatment at any medical establishment. It was those buffoons. They use that phony high-tech stuff. That music nonsense. So I should fire those slackers. And one more thing when I can tell. Speaking of hardcore Persona fans, do you think Richard Hugh has been one of those guys breaking his discs? <laughs> Sorry. Oh. Everyone's an acceptable target. Click. Oh, just another day. He definitely would be. We've got work to do, ready? He's one of those guys that's only played Persona 5 as well. None of the others. Oh, shit, we got a boss. I've read that as one more shift. One shift more. Right, here we go. Ready for some interface fuckery? I am. Oh, shit. Patient fell down the stairs. Oh! No one in chat say anything. History of heart block requiring swung rhythmic defibrillation. Okay, here we go. Press the space bar. <laughs> yeah, you know, Crow. <laughs> Do not elaborate or you're bad. Here we go, boss stage. I've been waiting for so long. Oh god, what lyrics this is throwing me off. Waiting for my doctor to come. These aches been going on for days now. And I'm feeling slightly down. Fuck! I'm sorry, Paige! I've been working night and day Haven't had a wink of sleep but She called me a clown? So she got a red nose and pressed it. So ah! Don't worry, it happens to the best of us, but more importantly, how are you feeling? I'm okay. 
everything well at home? Uh, I think so. Great, but we'll get you to charge tomorrow then. But is there anything else, sir? Well, you know, yes, my, my, my wife hasn't called since yesterday. We, we always okay, talk once yes, in Yes, oh, yeah. of course. But we'll get the nurse to call her up and see if she's... Oh, dear. Oh my god, so much is happening! <laughs> wow, regret the song. To all my friends that I have lost, or crossing bridges I have crossed, tennis weddings, cafe sessions, sorry I was never there. Wow. You see, I've been in call this week. I'm bad at getting any sleep. I love to catch up. I really wish. This song became a mood all of a sudden. But they've been waiting for so <laughs> there you are. Hand over was hey, an hour ago. Sorry, what man. took you so long? I'm so sorry. My mother had another episode. The car is running late. I couldn't just leave her there. I called up the hospital to try and let you know, but I guess they didn't. Oh, no, they. Uh, I, I'm I'm sorry to hear that. Thanks for covering, Ada. I really appreciate it. Uh, I hope the patients didn't give you too much trouble. No, not at all. Hey, okay, so um, Mr. Stevenson had a stroll yesterday. He's he's doing fine. But we still don't know if it was mechanical or syncope. He doesn't remember? No, actually, he won't hear. No history of AF? Not on the record. Aspiration pneumonia? No, none of that. We've got a mood swing of a son. Jesus Christ. <laughs> Poor man. <laughs> God, that's the thing in a hospital. Like, you're just stuck. Especially during these fucking times where it's the way, like, you can barely even get visitors. It's really sad, actually. Um, I can take it all from here. Thank you, both of you. You did great. When the last time I saw my granddad before he actually passed away in hospital because of fucking COVID was, uh, uh, a year. A year before he passed away was the last time I saw him, and that was on camera. Because, well, he was suffering a lot from um, stroke symptoms. And because um, of COVID, we couldn't visit him. And he passed. Which really sucks. Sorry, I know there's a bit of a mood swing there, but like... Just what happened here in the game sort of highlights how like lonely being stuck in a fucking hospital bed can be, man. That's that's fucking sad. Uh, but yeah, uh, that was that was quite a bit ago. But anyway, uh, thanks, man. Here, yeah, no worries, Paige. You're good. You're good. Ada, you look exhausted. You should clock out. I can handle everything. Yeah, yeah. I'll grab something to eat and make my way out. It was a real rough one. We couldn't have done it without you. Yeah, seeing that in the game just sort of reminded me of that. That's all. It's time to feel like you're the glue holding this place together. Good luck with the next shift. When you're ready, maybe we can drop by the vending machine? I'm starving. Get yourself a toffee crisp or a double decker or whatever the fuck. Page's office. Maybe there's a personal story in there. Yeah, that's the thing with like indie games, and because it's such a small team, I always feel like uh, games can be a lot more personalised as a result. So not all the time, but most of the time, you see it a lot. I've seen it loads in video in like indie games. Like it feels very personalised uh, in Celeste. It feels very personalised in Amori. It feels very personalised in uh, in this game too. But like indie indie games lately have just been very good. at that sort of expressing like the creator's personal feelings a lot more than like a triple A team, I feel. 
Of course I say Celeste first. Celeste is the big one when it comes to like indie feels. That's what I'm gonna call it now, indie feels. Hmm. Yeah, games are always better when they don't appeal to a big when they don't try to appeal to a bigger audience, but just like an, just an expression of art, which is what video games should be, really. Page's office. Let's keep on going. Hit the vending machine, yeah? How's Scruffy the Janitor doing? Ben, I fought too long and hard not to face the for you to give me to be named first. <laughs> That is a big one, though. But yeah, it, it should go about saying that video games are always better when they're an expression of art, more than trying to express to a, a wider audience, most definitely. If you see any big messes or spills, don't come right to me about it. But your job is to clean. Chances are I probably saw it already and put it on my to-do list. Fair enough. Cleaners work hard. We've got cleaners at our lifeguard place in the gym, and we've got one guy who is fucking on it, my man. It really does make a difference when you've got a good cleaner in your institution. Because uh, before we had certain good cleaners, there used to be just shit all over the place. And especially in the male changing rooms. And because I was the lifeguard on the night shifts and we had no cleaner most of the time, I was the one who always had to pick up the slack. But we finally got like a good cleaner who actually cares about his job and does good at it. So whenever I now finish my shift uh, on the pool and I come out to the locker room, it's immaculate and it's such a rare sight, but it's so nice to see. So fuck yeah, I appreciate your cleaners, boys. Absolutely appreciate them. But like, they're up there with the fast food people, like people you should respect. They clean the place where you're fucking, you know, stuffing your towel in. Hmm. Your stomach's being an arse, so you gotta lay down. Oh shit, take care of yourself, pal, okay? Yeah, no worries. I was always here if you wanna watch, but sit down, have a few drinks, and look after yourself, okay, pal? Final wank to see. <laughs> Alright, anyway, yeah, respect your janitors. If I close my eyes and procrastinate long enough, maybe it will disappear. Let's go to the vending machine. Eight years of med school for dinner from a vending machine. Not as glamorous as I told my friends it would be. Oh, there she is. Oh, it's Haiti. Third day in a row of putting off the groceries. It's just never any time. Too tired. <sighs> she need to go home, eat this protein bar and these chips, collapse and gobble off my next shift. My fucking god. All work and no play, mate. Page it all, girl. Bless. You can take a shower, no worries to you. Easy. Excuse me, Dr. Page. Oh, hello, Haley. Right? You've got like a patch of grass that follows you wherever you go. I wanted to um, ask you something. What's that? I know that I'm supposed to be staying in my room and recovering and all that, but would you be careful if I went on a trip and then come right back? My grandma, she asked me a favor. Her hometown is out west near the desert, but she can't leave to go visit. We have some distant family out there, and she wants me to deliver keepsakes to them, and she asked me to take pictures too. She hasn't seen the desert landscape and her hometown in so long, it's where she grew up. I know I'm not supposed to leave, but please, 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 I'll come right back. Hmm, I'm not sure. Edgar will completely explode at me if he hears about this. I'm actually clocked out for today. I need to head home. But this sounds important to you. I'll take it to Ian, but let's figure something out. Thank you, thank you. God, doctors and nurses work fucking hard. Honestly, like, we talk about janitors and working at fast food institutions, but people who work in healthcare, my Christ, do they not deserve our most utmost respect. Because not only are they working overtime literally every single fucking day, like, they're saving lives, dude. Leaving hospital care to take some pictures and deliver a box. Eco-friendly girlfriend. 
Isn't there probably some driver out that'll do that for you? Yeah, the, the grass moves about to pay on how she feels, man. Oh god, is it turning into a tree when she's in bed? Sorry, that was inappropriate. Plus, you can just print out some royalty-free dessert foes or something. That's when the roses grow. Eh? Eh? Eh. Ian, please, it's important to her. Fine. Hmm. Actually, maybe this could work. I've been working on the Room Doctor's program. I should be able to work at even further ranges than we've been using. Further out from the hospital's computers. This could be an opportunity for the intern to help me test it out. If the connection holds a few towns over, then we'll be able to tell Dr. Edgar that we can treat even more patients. People won't even need to leave their homes to get treatment. Elderly patients, immobile patients, it could be helpful. The sound of the waiting room will be nice and empty, and we can actually have lives for once. So we'll let her go out for a day. Imagine playing video games and actually help heal people. Like, a doctor can literally just get their life back by just other people playing games. Yeah, let's do it. Go clock out, Ada. Thanks for the help. And for you, you're gonna follow Haley on her train trip out west. Keep an eye on her, and minister any treatment she needs. This will be a great way to test the connection and push its capabilities. Good luck! Oh shit, we're legit me on the train. Cool. Uh, train doctor's train ride performance. A bystander on the train is experiencing severe chest pain. This may require any method of remote defibrillation. I think I've overworked myself a bit. Think you can fix me up? My man, I'm on my way. Gonna make dinner, Crow? Yeah, don't worry if you miss it. The VOD is always there. No pressure at all. Hello from the hospital. Can you hear me okay? Looks like you're looking to help a minor on the train, huh? Looking at the cardiogram results coming in, and it looks like it will require a new method of treatment. Under Edgar and Paige's care in the hospital, a condition like this would require pretty serious procedures. Lucky for him, I was recently experimenting with a new way to use the rhythm defibrillator. To do the types of intense defibrillation necessary to restore his heart's functions, you're going to need to hold the button down instead of top it. Honestly, uh, if I was using a defib to help someone uh, with CPR at work and a gamer was controlling it, like this game right now, might be a little bit concerned. Just saying. Green kind of beats will cue you on how long you'll need to hold. Let's give it a try. Okay. Oh. Oh, I gotta hold it. Oh. What? Oh my god. Okay. It's this kind of thing. Full battery. Ah, okay. Oh wow, that's a toughie. A longer hold. Oh. Uh. Have I done CPR for real? Luckily not. Thank fuck. Uh, only CPR I've done is basically in training, which they really knuckle into you every three months. You have to go through like dips and go through uh, um, training programs every single time. Uh, dip is drowning prevention, by the way. Uh, yeah, you go through. You basically go through a training program every three months just to sort of like remind you because um, uh, honestly. Uh, if you don't get a lot of action as a lifeguard, that's a good thing. Because being part of a lifeguard is to make sure accidents don't happen in the first place. But in case they do, yeah, uh, we've got to be ready for CPR. Whenever bad shit happens or like you get a spine or, or god forbid. Especially because our pool is really, really shallow too. The fact that it's so shallow means that if someone jumps in there like an idiot and ignores all the signs, we've got to be like, oh fuck. Like, that's probably going to be a spinal because it's that, like, low down to the floor. Which is a scary thing. So, uh, yeah. The old saying is that a good lifeguard is a dry lifeguard. And luckily there have been no accidents at the club. So, yeah. I tend to keep it that way. 
Oh no, I've tripped and knocked over the water cooler. Now I'm drowning. If only there was a handsome lifeguard to give me CPR. <laughs> Oh, I love that. It's I love that you're drowning just by knocking over a water cooler as well. Like that, that is some fucked up accident. <laughs> oh, that is actually an accident where literally the entire club would be at your beck and call, mate. So honestly, a pretty good strategy. Anyway, I'll demonstrate. Oh, no! Oh, keep holding. Listen for the pop sounds and release on the fourth one. That's that's a weird one. Okay. Okay. Oh, you went faster. Fuck you. Oh, that's a toffee actually. Leave face time flopping it. <laughs> Fine, let's go over a trickier type of hold. Well, that one was pretty tricky on its own. We have to release the button when it's time. All right. I'm just winging it. I'm literally just winging it. It's a tricky concept, as so it might take a few more tries to have the new method down. Even so, it's our best method available for helping that miner. He's completely unaware of how delicate his heart's condition is right this second. You know, you're pretty selfish for treating a complete stranger out of there. Haha, <laughs> it's not like I've got an audience to entertain or anything. You remind me of Ada. <laughs> anyway, that's all from me. Good luck. This is how I progress in the game, Ian. I've got no choice but to help people. Oh boy. Here we go! Hey, Samurai's there. What? Oh, fuck. No, he's free. He can't be free. He's got to be trapped forever. A tough part's coming. That was pretty tough. Okay, I'll do my best. Sorry, man. C no, that's terrible. Ah. C plus. Oh, I hate that. A B at least. Go back. Go back. Shit. I don't need no stinky tutorial. Wait, exit of NS? Yeah. Cool. Yeah. Put me back in, coach. Did you do this first time, Tia?
妈。Ah! Va 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 va! No, didn't happen. Didn't happen. Didn't happen. Didn't happen. No, you didn't win. You didn't win. First try, easy. Next! <laughs> Thanks for the save, bud. Mm. Are you okay? You look like you were in pain. Yeah, I'm feeling a little bit now. Where are you headed, kid? Are you on a school trip? Oh no, not school. I'm visiting Golden Rock, the town where my grandma grew up. I have a delivery to make, and I'm taking photos. You should nab a shot at the view whipping by. I bet you don't get a landscape like this where you're from. It's a bunch of sandy bullshit. Ain't exactly Iceland, sorry. The colder the country, the more I'm gonna like it, just saying. Oh, you're right. Let me get my camera. Look at that cactus. It's so spiky. Amazing. Oh, this is so cool. Beast being cooped up in that hospital bed. Hey, that's gonna blurry. Look at the dusty fog is rolling in. We get that a lot. At least you get a nice filter if you're stuck in a frozen wasteland. Minus the electric deer, where in a desert, it's just yellow. In a desert, you're, you're literally just... It's literally just that. Like, fuck that. Yeah, colder places are more my jam. Which is why I'm looking forward to Scotland this year. It's got dusty fog is rolling in. We get that a lot. Might get a bit hard to see. That's gonna be a game mechanic, isn't it? You can't fool me, game. Oh. Are you okay? Get me in Siberia? No, oh, if I'm getting Siberia, I'm dying in Siberia. You, doctor person. Can you help us, please? I suppose we're gonna have to. Oh, she's crying. Don't worry, ma'am. I'll save your grass. Uh, get so foggy out there. Hey, and that miner are both experiencing flare ups. Visibility is low. Treat them the best you can. This is why hot country suck. I shall help you. Do not worry. Oh, I'm not gonna like this level, am I? Getting close to where you stopped. Oh shit.
A fuck off politician, you're not welcome. Oh my fucking Christ. <sighs> oh. Oh. Oh, this is a rough one. Holy shit. Okay, we're going through a bunch of these. Mate, mate, that was all over the place. Wow, this is getting really tough. C plus. <laughs> Get me back in there, man. Get me back in there. All right, I've got to concentrate. <laughs> got to activate a galaxy brain for this one, guys. I'm glad you're having new sounds to you. Can't move this bed ends here. <laughs> it's not a bad idea, Jerry. I've got a spare slot, so maybe. I'll have to replace John Travolta or GG with it though. So it's on the second try. Second try always wins out. Second comes right after first. Whoever you are out there, you saved my tail twice. Wish I could thank you properly. Oh, I could break these costs. It's actually a really good suggestion. Truth be told, it's been a while since I've been to the doctor, but I've got to add the scream in there too. Maybe I've been pushing myself to my limit. What should I do, doc? Anything I should eat different, or don't need to step away from work for a while. Don't stop fucking working. Guess you can't talk, huh? 
I'm not a medic. No, I'm I am knocking on my monitor and telling you to stop, Miner. It's time to stop. I'll have to find someone who can help me out. Thanks for trying. Fuck. Just hang tight, hope for the best. Oh my god. Oh hi Ian. Can you shift your focus back to the hospital for a second? Mrs. Stevenson says she needs help with her uh, buzz? With Paige at home and Edgar making the rounds, everything needs to be perfect. Let's sort his patience out and then you can continue on with your work on the train. Alright. I'm gonna help a bro out. A report from Middlesea Hospital is coming in. A few unusual patients need attention right away. I'm coming! Oh my fucking Christ, it's four right off the bat. Okay, here we go. I could have burst my South Park a little bit. Fuck off! <laughs> Fuck. Can we trade? Well, I'm glad your birds are in one piece, lady. B plus. I'll take it. I'll take it. B plus is a pass, isn't it, birdie? Oh, thank Christ. Ooh. Oh my God. That was a tough one. Miss Stevenson is over the moon. I guess now we're her favorite vet's office too. You can go back to what you were doing. Later. Never ask me for help ever again. Oh, it's you again. Why does that guy look so familiar? Hi, do I know you? Are you from Middle Sea Hospital? That's me. Wow! What are the chances? What are you doing here? Were you released? Your stay's over? Ha, huh, not even close. I what you did. It's not help. Oh shit, we can't keep having this. Rumors gonna fucking fly about. People are just gonna leave the hospital and we're gonna get in trouble. Didn't sneak out, I got permission. My motivation has been starting to come back, but I don't want to wait for some boring 12-step program. So I figured maybe sneaking out. The grandma sprite is very cute, yes. Getting a change of scenery, I would help jolt my brain. 
That makes sense. Being all cooped up in the hospital probably isn't helpful for inspiration. It's pretty lonely in there. I'm lucky I get to hang with Logan. Yeah, lucky there's no pandemic flowing about. He's, well, um, he's just a guy from my school. I feel like there's more to the story than that. We're out on a train in the middle of the desert. Spill the beans. Oh, okay, fine. We're friends, but it's more than that. I think he has feelings for me. You know, like a crush on me. Now you're a happy couple. Dope. Well, that's the thing. He hasn't actually said it out loud yet. It's just obvious. You know, the way he fucking danced with me in that one song, I feel the same way, but it's just so wishy-washy. He's always hiding what he's feeling or thinking. He can't say it. We spent a lot of time together, but I just want to get to know him more. I don't mind waiting around if he's shy, but... This is a girl that does not exist in real life, by the way, people. If you're wishy-washy about your feelings, the girl will just fucking ignore you and move on until someone else comes onto her. <laughs> Sorry. I, I didn't mean to put that negativity in the chat, but that's just my that's just my experience coming into play, people. If you want him to pick up on your feelings, you gotta send him the vibes. Sign that for him to take the hint. That's not true! Was that a good impression of Ben? I've got an idea. I'll put it up on the track. Here, take a listen. Alright. No you. Let's go. Nah, man, Joe, that's not true. There are girls like that. Yes, there are. I'm positive and I believe. Nah, 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 there is. A plus better impression. Nice. GG! Sorry. Gamer girls don't exist. <laughs> oh, Colin and Haley are experiencing continuous symptoms and are both absent from the ward. <laughs> Here with the S word, Joe. I can't! I'm not allowed to! He's got me under streaming conditions. He wins this round. I can't say it. Hi, Dr. Finger. That's how a lot of people call me. Don't tell Dr. Page right after I got on the train. I know it's my heart beating in a new way. There's no Tooth Fairy. There's no Easter Buy. There's no Gamer Girl. There's no Far Christmas. And there's no Nagato. I don't think it's a big deal, but I figured you might want to practice it before we hear Cole's song. On the same feet. Okay. Oh, I like that. It's a symbol too. Wonderful. It's a relief having you around. So, um, remember when I said a new way? Promise you won't tell? Yeah, there's another one. You might want to check it out. That was great! Yeah, I think I've got that down. Oh, this is the last song where you, uh, before you ended off, Tia. Oh, fair enough. I shall make you pr- uh oh I shall make you proud. <laughs> as soon as I saw the screen start off smaller. Get set. Oh, fuck. This is hard, my fingers are all sweaty and sticky. Sorry for that mental image chat. Oh my fucking Christ. I can't wait to start this brand new song. I bet it's going to be a good one for the fourth one. I bet it's going to be really good. Oh god, the screen's small. That's a cause for concern. Get set. Go. Let's 
Fuck you. Fuck you. I had that. Ah! 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 Nice try. Fuck! Oh, I couldn't even see it. Fuck you. No! 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 It's all falling apart! No! I passed. That was somehow I passed. <laughs> Taking the W, boys and girls. Holy shit. <laughs> Tia is absolutely seething. I'm sorry, Tia. Look, it's only fair that I get to succeed you. You are the older family member, after all. The wiser. The, the wiser, more grizzled family member, you know, the younger one who gets your uh, amazing tear genes. It only makes sense. Welcome to the first try, Club Boy. Yep, that was, uh, that was totally first try. No resets whatsoever. I like it. I didn't realize you were, like, actually a musician. No offense. Ouch. Thanks. Send that song along to that Logan guy, and he'll pick up on what you're saying. It took you four tries. Honestly, I didn't think I was going to get a B plus on that one. It honestly felt like I failed. It counts as a miss, bro, because it isn't the most obvious of cues. Yeah, I'm I'm literally... I'm actually like... They, they show you what's doing the tutorial. But most of the time, I'm actually winging it. Like, I'm actually just moving my head to the beat and just hoping that I get it. And it's actually been working out for me, funny enough. But this is spoiler territory for Tia. So she should be good. Yeah, she's off. Uh, time to flee. This is new territory. Bye bye. Yep, see you later, Tia. No worries. Good luck in your endeavors with um, Reverend Doctor 2. Hopefully, I'll make them. Depends on how far I am. Take care, Tia. Thanks for coming by. Looks like we've arrived at my stop. I'll be off then. I've got to take lots of pictures for my grandma. I'll show you around town. Let's go find those folks of yours. Great, thank you. Oh, hey, what's your name again? Cole. Cole, I'm Haley. I'll see you back at the hospital, right? 
You know, now I snuck out, I was tempted to just make a run for it and never come back. But whether I like it or not, the hospital is the best place to hang out with Nicole. So yeah, I'll definitely see you there. Good work, intern. But I, uh, you, re what? oh, uh, everything okay? Oh shit! I need you at the hospital. Please come back right now. Man, this guy is shitting and farting as he needs me back. I better go help him before he makes a mess. Boss. Oh boy. One accent. Super battle worm insomniac. You're back, thank god. You can still hear me, right? Something happened while you were gone. It almost severed your connection to the hospital. Put MGS2 on us. Looks like Paige is back for a shift too. What's going on? Why is power flickering on and off? You're just in time. I'm not sure what's happening. Our network just became really unstable. It keeps losing connection. My PC started overheating. All of them are. And now even the electricity in the building is given out. Oh fuck. The backup generators have taken over, but they're starting to overheat too. Even my phone is acting strange. Everyone's upset, man. Did something happen? Did the power line go down? Wait, forget it. Am I trying to beat the game today? I'll see how far I get. I'll probably keep on streaming until about... Maybe 11. So about 40 more minutes left, we'll see. Forget, how are the patients? Is everyone okay? Oh, I started checking everyone as soon as I could. Nobody's condition is out of the ordinary except for... That chronic insomnia patient from earlier. His heart rate is out of control again. The virus that was jamming our signal. Whatever, it doesn't matter. In turn, let's go, we need you. Can't this virus take hold of the building? There's so many patients here. Oh god, it's a virus again. Just focus on the seventh beat no matter what. Red highlights, very important, remember. Okay. This might be some demonic shit that we jump into, ladies and gents. So let's jump right on in. Seventh beat, seventh beat. Oh. <laughs> okay. Oh, stag. Oh my god. Oh my god. Relapse, but, but how? <laughs> Jokes on you, I don't use WhatsApp. It's broken off a chunk of his heart. I hope you're good at a regular time, Doc. Here we go. Piece of shit. <laughs> Honestly, got full. That was part of the game. Oh my fucking god! Put me back in, coach. Put me back in. Rigged from the start. Let me in. Absolutely rigged. Robbed and bamboozled. Let's go. I like how you can make the finger move before it presses the button. Mm. 
Shut up. I love how I said this from Reverend Doctor too. Seems I was completely off the beat that time. <laughs> Shit. Way fucking off. <clears throat> Alright, um... Anyway. Mate, you miss one beat, you're missing all of them on that segment. <laughs> oh shit, so close. Doctor? Doctor!
I wish Tia the best of fucking luck on this one. I am unbelievably sweaty right now. I... Thankfully, there's no webcam where you guys are.
until this is done. Bad, bad.
one night complete. Ah! 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 <laughs> oh, <sighs> can't remember the last time a game gave me this much fulfillment. A rhythm game, no bloody less. Jesus, man. God, that regular beat was throwing me right off. <laughs> I'm gonna put my shirt back on, I'll be right back. It's, it's very hot night, considering the season. <sighs> He's gonna be okay, guys, we did it. Oh. oh, that was fun. <laughs> oh, thank you, everyone. Um, Tia, if you're watching this, um, it sucked for me too. <laughs> what should I do at first try or something? The power's back on. Everything seems to be working now. I, I had no idea this virus would infect the building itself. Where does it keep coming from? If we keep working, you should eventually be able to figure it out, right? I think so, yeah. Ugh. Well, we did it. Great work, everyone. Now what? I'm sure it's only a matter of time before something else unexpected turns up. So until then, just keep doing what we always do. Making the rounds and checking on our patients. You need to check whether Mr. Stevenson's bad, uh, bad settings? Bed settings are comfortable. I also double check that Mrs. Stevenson has tapioca pudding. It helps her swallow her pills. Whatever it takes to make everyone stay as comfortable as possible. Oh, speaking of patients, what about Haley? I hope her trip went okay. I'm back! I'm doing great! And look, I found someone who was trying to run away. Shh, told you I come back. They anyway, miss me. Did you leave the hospital just so you could drink coffee without us noticing? What? No. There's a cup in your hand right now. Welcome back, dude. I'm sure somebody must have missed you. Boy, Mr. and his music. Anyway, I was looking for Dr. Page. Me? Why? Because the power's back. Everything was bugging out. There was a flash of light. And now it's all fixed. That must have been you two and the intern, right? Yes, we've got it all under control. If anyone has any questions, I can help. You did it. Thank you. I also have a grass growing out my ass. I've got literal grass ass. The grass ass couple. Did you get scared in the dark? Your legs are shaking. No, they aren't. Oh, the lights are back on. Are you two for doctors? Maybe you can help me. Yes, ma'am. If you go back to your room, we'll be right with you. Thank you. Thank you, doctors. Feels like our weight has finally been lifted. Of course. Let us know if you're any more pain or discomfort. Hello? What sort of commotion out there? Where's my cane? There's a party. Don't have you be starring about me. Ha cha cha cha. Ha cha cha cha. So, your physical therapy definitely hasn't started yet. Please stay in your bed. Looks like you're getting even more popular around here, Doc. Thanks for everything. Let me know when my rehab starts. I'm ready when you are. Thanks for letting me go on that trip for my grandma, Dr. Page. Thanks for the advice and finding motivation. If you're ever bored, you should come by and hear this new place I put together. Thank you, Doctor. You're welcome, everyone. If you all head back up to your rooms, I'll gladly visit you all so we can catch up. And you, in turn. Think you can stick around and perfect your rhythm treatments for them? You're officially part of our Middle Sea Hospital staff now, as far as I'm concerned. Thank you so much for everything you've done so far. There's still lots to get done. Whenever you're ready, let's get started. And the whole hospital looks up to the sky. Sub story rhythm doctor complete. Do 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 do. Cute credit scene. I've been waiting for so long. <laughs> Watch me fuck up this credit scene. Oh, it's actually the toughest song in the game. We used to have heart to hearts. <laughs> lately we're a world apart. 
how much? No more! We folks are odd, but we are kind. Yay! Can we help you ease your mind? Everyone's gonna Can die at the end, and it's all my fault. Sun is up, you're done after it's gone. But still, the work keeps piling up. Don't feel like you belong. Shit! Oh, we're gonna stop very soon. Help me, help you, help us better make me The boss fight has thrown off my rhythm completely. This is when I resigned from being the rhythm doctor. What the fuck is this nonsense? Yeah, these be the ones I can't save. Do I get graded on this? I hope not. Hey, we're gonna get a, to get this is how you get the bad ending or some shit. Oh god, it's still a page. God fucking. I did it. I completely aced the entire game. I'm fantastic. Woohoo! Yeah, go me! Hey, look at that. Absolute complete river master. Just like I said. Just like I said in the intro. I told you. Completely told you. <laughs> oh, that was fun. That was a fun game. I quite enjoy it from Doctor. It's funny how much pressing a single button can sometimes... Like, this game fucks you up just by pressing a button, but it does, like, variants of it too. It's still in the beat. It's funny how, like, it puts into perspective how a game can still screw you up even when you're just pressing one button. It's quite cool. I like it a lot. There's a Muse Dash collab. Oh, that's awesome. Amazing Triple S 100% speedrun. Rip and Champ. Yep, that's me. <laughs> There's some extra tracks you might want to check out if you want to. Cool, cool, cool. Um, it's not 11 just yet. I suppose we could look at some other stuff. Um, collaboration. Kind of like a collaboration. Will there be songs that I might recognize in collaboration by any chance? You had fun? Hey, me too, man. It got pretty tense near the end, but yeah. It was a fun little game, and then we had like an actual like little trial at the end there. The tracks on story mode or mode. Oh, okay. I just got distracted by calibration. And I just thought, what if I click on calibration? Because what are the songs that I? No, no, no. I didn't think the tracks were on calibration. I just saw calibration. I thought, oh, what if I, what if there are songs that I recognise on calibration? That's for syncing taps to beats. That's making the beats and images match. Oh, oh! Fucking collab. Oh my fucking god. I'm. I've had enough. <laughs> god. That fucking song really did take it out of me, didn't it? It seems like I'm very exhausted, ladies and gents, as you can see by me. Literally being illiterate as all fuck. Holy shit. That's my brain right now. Uh. <laughs> fuck me. Uh. That never happened. Let's go to story mode. Help enhances a C plus. I. <laughs> no, don't let your pride get in the way, Joe. You're here to look at more songs. 
bonus. Uh, Lucia Moon. This patient doesn't seem to be feeling well. She's sitting in the corner with some kind of sketchbook. My brain is absolutely like that. There, there is smoke coming out of my ear holes right now. The fact that oh, that's cute. I fucking love it. The fact that I had to take off my shirt like it was a bloody yakuza stream during a song in a rhythm game just says it all. Can't stuck right now. Some artist block. Oh shit. Happens to the best of us. Wait, maybe you can help? I know a fun little thing we can do. Here, you just draw a big scribble. Just a couple of random lines. When I look here and turn it into something. Makes sense? Oh shit. Muse dash wines close to the vending machine. I'll have a look for it after. Sounds like something out of an Undertale game. Get set one. <laughs> A grumpy alligator. Thanks, nurse. Thanks for telling me it was coming, bitch. <laughs> Sorry. So a portrait. Mine's just a bunch of scribbles. Okay, RPG time. Ah, oh, it's a doctor's. You're welcome, guys. A plus. Yeah. That was fun. We should do this again. So, uh, this was the early access version from what I've been seeing. I actually didn't know I had that. I thought I just had the normal one. Oh my god, someone is, uh, uh someone is, is ready. Is that, that looks like a Muse Dash character. That looks like, what's her name? Rin. Yeah, the, uh, with the guitar. It is, yeah, it's Rin. Yeah, it's totally Rin. MD. Nice. All right, let's do this. Rin, Marija, and Bro. Yeah, these are the. They're the. Uh, cool, 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 cool. All right, uh, let's, let's see what this is like then. Before we go forward, there's a special type of SVT. Oh, okay, got a specific one for the Muse Dash collab. Have you? Sometimes patients will experience one-time unexpected fluctuations in their rhythm. They're short and quick, but they're just as important to treat carefully. The nurse will cue with a get set one to help you. Instead of continuing to hit every beat, like with the SVT beats, you just hit it once. Sometimes the nurse gets tired and leaves you to hear the sound cue instead. For that, that also means you just hit what you should hit just once off the queue okay here we go tom sawyer fuck got it it's 
quite tough. I got the gist of it though. And there says two instead of one. You'll then hear these two sounds. I swear to God, I've got to press a button twice. And you'll press to fuck. <laughs> it makes sense, but I'm not looking forward to it. That was a fan community Three, thing that made it real. Two, That's cool. What? No, 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 I need more practice. What? Vroom. Dif what? No time to lose. What? What? Hold on. I don't understand. I somehow got that! I'm not sure if this is safe to go into with a melted brain. Some sort of chase going on downtown. Oh, please say it's for- Yeah! Oh my god, please- Is it the one where, um, what's her name is the boss and she chucks shit and missiles at you and stuff? That's like my favourite Muse Dash level. Yeah, it is. That's cool. It's, it's straight up a Muse Dash level. I can't say song. Muse Dash. They got the sound effects and everything. It just feels like I'm playing like a, what is it, 32 bit Muse Dash? Oh, fuck. I get to mash it. the same results music too. Unironically, probably my favorite level in this game. <laughs> hey, actor Deck, how's it going? Welcome to the stream. You all right? Okay, so I stood by. That was quite the car chase. Yeah, we can barely breathe. Why are you chasing a limo anyway? That Mr. Hughes is a pretty high-ranking guy, you know. 
Plus, I'm pretty sure he hates us already. I'm doing alright. Yeah, my brain's been turned to mush by this game, especially by his end game. But we're just gonna end off in a sec, it's 11 o'clock. But yeah, been having fun with it. The grumpy guy in the big suit stole my favourite donut. I saw it first. I'm oh, sorry, what? We're not from here. We're on summer break. We walked past a nice bakery and... I saw the deluxe blueberry cream cheese donut first, but that man cut right in front of me. He took it! And that was the last one. Oh, yeah. You don't- you just deal with- you just don't- yeah, you don't do that. You mad about donut? <laughs> Donuts are important. Donuts are everything. Anyway, what's with the uh, costume? Should you really be walking around town dressed like that? Yes. They're about to fix this problem. They're gonna medicate the guy who stole the donut. Hey bud, I remember asking your opinion. Ouch. You might need to stay the night until your heart is back to normal and you pass for tomorrow. Sightseeing. Going to a club. Food tour. Ah, I see. Well, be careful out there. Oh, <laughs> we can do some more. I'll tell you what, we'll, we'll do these two. We'll do this one and we'll do the one we unlock after this. Not because I should, but because I want to. Oh. This must also be a song from Muse Dash. Nice. I know this one. Oh, I know this one. Am I sad for knowing this? Muse Dash is a fun ribbon game, what can I say? Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. Marjo is not impressed. I think I did okay. See? No! <laughs> Again! Put it back in, coach. I've caught the beat. I can do this. I'm feeling that funky rhythm. I can't fail my muse dash girls. <laughs> Not live in front of everyone. Real girls might be watching.
totally a B minus. Again. Can't lose. We've got to fight this thing. We've got to make the moose dash go as proud. Can't let them know I suck outside of their game. Song free. Tell me, fine doctor, where else? Tell me, your chest is gonna explode. Anyway, thanks again. Our hearts all fixed up. We'll show you to your rooms. Get you some water so you can't wine before. What? We're not gonna be yet. There's still time to party. The night is young. It sure is. You know, I was hoping to find some sort of live music or clubs or something. Are there any local venues you recommend? Uh, Middle Sea isn't exactly the coolest town for like clubbing and partying. Ian, you've never partied. I was there through all of med school. You stayed inside every weekend. Point taken. Pretty sure it's an old roller disco. A bit of a gimmick, but that could be something fun to do. To I've done roller disco in before. That shit's fun. Hey, cheers, Lazarin. Let's go. Right now. See ya. And they're gone. All right, the last one. Right. Whether we actually beat this or not, I'm sure it's going to be a fun time regardless, so let's go. The nice decision. The visitors have spotted Secretary Richard Hugh at the Royal Disco. The heart rates have spiked erratically. Ah, oh, shit. Don't worry, girls, I'm coming. Oh, it's actually a Royal Disco. That's cool. Rin hitting that yonky sploinky on the rink. Just never done something like this before. It's not so bad. Just get a Ryan start and skate through the rest. Mate, roller skating is hard. I've done it before and it's, it's fucking difficult. The way I do it is I just stomp my feet on the ground like diagonally and that sort of like gets you going. But like tricks and spins and all that shit, yeah, that's, that's a whole other level. But trying new things are scary. It always makes my heart race. Your heart. Oh boy. Oh, here we go again. You mentioned the H, boy. You shouldn't have done that. No, I've got to come in. Fuck me. Do, 
Du, 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 I'm getting the hang of it, but I'm probably not gonna win. Should pick up the pace and skate for real now? No. Yeah, let's rumble. No, chill out. No. Wait, can we pause and get something to eat first? I could use a snack. Snack bar was closed. Trust me, I checked. Sucks for you. I stole my donut back from that old guy while he was talking on the phone. Bro. How did you even steal that donut back? The guy didn't eat it yet. I guess not. Hey, boy, with him here. Look, he's over there. Oh, the anticipation is killing me. Can you just play the song? Find his keepers. Oh, get her. Not too fast, though. Remember, I've got to measure your heart rates. Oh, fuck me. Okay, what song is it going to be? Is it what I want to know? Donut. <laughs> Wee! Sarah is playing Warframe, an objectively worse game than Rhythm Doctor. Okay, here we go. Holy fuck. Oh my, oh my god, all the wop wops. Ah! Were you, were you other characters piss off? Oh my god! Get out of the way! Get, get, get out of the way! Ah, my wrist hurts! My wrist hurts! Oh, it hurts! What am I doing? Oh! Oh! Jesus, that was like the equivalent of like a level nine muse song. Jesus Christ, yeah, they're not holding back on these later ones, are they? <laughs> I think you've heard the song. I think that is going to be it for tonight, ladies and gents. The donut is stale. I should probably go downstairs and eat my own before mine gets stale. Holy fuck. Oh, that is going to be it for the night, I think, everyone. Thank you very much for joining me. Um, the game I want to stream, uh, I have not got yet. I'm getting it for Christmas. So I thought it would be nice to just, you know, just play, a, uh, just, just play a little game. I can jump on and off here and there. And Rhythm Games are always a good choice. So, yeah, thank you guys for voting for Rhythm Doctor. I am happy to have discovered a new Rhythm game that isn't Muse Dash. And I'm looking forward to playing more of it in my own time. Yeah, I'll probably just jump on here and there when I've got time. But yeah, thank you guys for joining for the stream. Thank you very much for getting me to high train level 5 out of nowhere. And for literally extending this stream by like 40 minutes before we even started. Thank you very much for that. I'm glad you guys enjoy the new sounds too. Oh, you can do... Wait, you can do them both at the same time. Wait, hang on a minute. Let me try this combination. Uh, uh... 
Amazing. Fantastic. Oh, I'm going to add some more. I'm going to add some more. You guys seem to really like these, so I'm definitely going to add some more. Uh, this was a fun one. Yeah, thank you very much. Yeah, this game's got a lot of charm to it. Honestly, when I heard that it, only, it was only one button to actually play the game, I was like, oh, what's what's the most they can do from that? I'm sure it's a pretty simple rhythm game. It's not. Uh, it gets very difficult in the end, and it will find ways to strain your wrist and make you rip off your shirt and suffocate in your own sweat and jizz and shit and coom. Just like I did with that final boss fight. So thank you guys very much for being able to witness that. I will see you guys next time. Thank you very much. Um, I will probably not be able to stream before Christmas. So everyone have an absolutely fantastic festive time. Um, happy holidays, as the Americans say. And yeah, have a proper crimber, everyone. Thank you very much and have yourself a fantastic winter. See you guys probably next year. I think with Yeah, next year because I've got my Scotland trip on the 27th. See you guys next year, everyone. I'll probably still be in the discord if you want to talk to me in like text form but streaming wise it's going to be in january at some point so thank you guys very much for stopping by thank you guys for making the last stream of the year a great one we got to high train level five thank you so much and as usual have you yourselves a fantastic one thank you guys very much i'll see you next time love you all thank you you're a fantastic audience thank you for thank you for watching me be a good rhythm doctor goodbye Love you.